Goodby. Hopefully it's worth simply this your boy N-O-R-E. What up, it's DJ E-F-N. And this Drink Champs Happy Hour. Make some noise! <laughs> now, usually, you know, when we start the show and we do this show, we I give like, you know, a, 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 a intro introducing these people. But I'm just gonna just read off stats. Let's just start off stats. Let's go. Four-time NBA champion. Hmm. Three-time NBA Finals MVP. NBA Most Valuable Player 2000. 15 times NBA All-Star. Three times NBA All-Star Game MVP. All-Star NBA First Team. All-Star NBA Second Team. All-NBA Third Team. NBA All-Defensive Second Team. NBA Rookie of the Year. NBA All-Rookie First Team. NBA Scoring Champion. Two times IBM Award winner. NBA anniversary team, retired at 34, and it just, it just keeps going. You forgot one. Okay. And the only one to go platinum. And the mm, only one. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to say we didn't get into all that stuff. Hold on. Hold on. I, I still got my intro. Oh, Hold on. We got to okay. drink to that. Okay, let's drink to that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so, I my own drink. So, yeah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. okay, okay. Oh, 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 oh. So, so. I'm about to bring The best on record. Don't worry about what I'm drinking. No, no chasing. No chasing. Listen, listen, listen. <laughs> the best basketball player, rapper of all time. I need another drink. I'm gonna go ahead and say that. Of all time. The only hey, yo, basketball whoa, 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 player that whoa. got a platinum plaque. We doing a lot of talking. Where y'all drinks at? Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Come on, man. So in case y'all don't know what the yeah. fuck yeah. we talking about, we talking about the one, only oh, on Shaq So I'm going to drink some champagne because okay. I'm, I'm we, we don't know if you know if our show is about our show is about giving people their flowers and we wanted to start off this right show off, by giving right you your flowers early right off right time, right even right. though they might have some greasy fingers because they right right. 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 Hey, you know what? Papa no, forget all that crap. Come on, man, drink. He can't get his drink. Come on, man, drink, man. He can't get his drink. Come on, so come on big dog. Come on, big dog. Come on, big dog. Come on, man. 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 Don't ask it, me what I'm drinking. No, no, no. It said, it said yeah. you own Papa John's. And I don't own I, Papa John's. I, you, I don't own Papa John's. You, but you, you have you own some I'm of on them. The, I'm on the board. Okay. So, so when the Papa John's whole fiasco went down. The, the racial things, let's just be clear. They called me and I said, I'll be involved if old boy is not involved. Mm. So... They uh, made me the first African American member on the board, and you know we put some females on the board, and we're doing well now. You know the guy that's in charge, a guy by the name of Jeff Smith, he he brought me along. I wish I owned my own thing, but Jeff Smith owns it, and I'm just the first and only African American member on the board of Papa John. So you know we're doing big things now. You said first and only. Yeah. Like you start somewhere. Start somewhere. Start Yes. I want to see a face too. I want to see a face. So why, 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 why are you, on, man? Why, why you don't have it? <laughs> well, out of all the things, that, uh, the positions that you've been offered, because uh, 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 I heard you were supposed to get, you supposed to be about down with Starbucks at first. No, what happened was, mm. I could have been the first one to open up a Starbucks in the hood. So, uh, wow. all right, that, that's the key word. Yeah. So the owner of Starbucks, he, he came and he said, Shaq, I want to open up a Starbucks in the hood. And I'm thinking about where I'm from. I'm like, Jersey City, Jersey, right? No, no, New, New, York, York. New York. I'm like, that ain't going to work in the in, 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 Oh, you in, said in it won't work. Yeah, I, I told him to the fast. You thought you didn't drink coffee? No, yes, I did. I, I was like, my man, that ain't going to work. Because, like, I'm thinking hood, but I ain't know nothing about regentrification. Right, right. That's what they're doing. <laughs> So after I turned it down, the Magic Johnson did it. You know, made a lot of money. But you know, I was just trying to, I was trying to stay, stay true to my roots because nobody in my family drank coffee. So yeah. I was like, 
I was like, Howard Schultz, you know, who's a good friend of mine, the owner of, of, of Starbucks. I was like, ah, I don't think I, I, it, it'll work. And my guy was kicking me under the table like, like, yo, take these Starbucks. Like, it was going to be Shaquille O'Neal Starbucks. He's like, take these Starbucks there. I was that's like, crazy. I don't, that would have been I don't crazy. Think it's crazy. Wow. I mean, but that's, that's why... That's why. That's why when we say educate yourself, mm-hmm. it's not all about going to school. It's just like it's just like learn. Like you got to know what's going on in your neighborhood. Right. I know. Where, I know what regentrification is now in North because yeah. I'm doing it. Yeah. Uh, me and my uh, uh, group, the Bore Group, were responsible for tearing down the projects right. and building condos and building you in know mix, yes, and oh, wow. And what are you doing with the people that are there and now? We, so we have uh, you know we charge some people, but you know we let people you know do the uh, Section Eight thing. You know we get people jobs so. Right. You know, we're beautifying, you know, the city. Yeah, the, not the displacing people. Right. Oh, never. Right, right, right. Oh, never that. Right. All right, drink to that. This is yeah. good. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Good. Yeah. 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 good. So, so I seen you and Damien. No, Damien, no, Damien, you, Damien, no, I'm drinking. You're a lot of talking. You're a drinker. I'm drinking to your champagne. You're like a gun strategy. Gun strategy. What? No, yeah. Let's just be clear. Do you feel like you're the best basketball rapper of all times? Yes. I do too. I, I, I mean, got your back. Yeah. Yeah. Not because of bars or whatever, it's because of my discography. Right. So Actually, I actually got record with Big and Nas. Yes, I, I figured out that. So, one, you know, we all come from the same place. Like, like basketball and music is right there. So, for me, I'm not on the court. I'm LL Cool J. I went to the flea market mm-hmm. and got the fake mm-hmm. dookie rope yeah. and got the can't go. That's what I'm saying. So yeah. I'm in the mirror. Mm-hmm. And then when I get to the court, I'm Dr. J. So when I first got drafted, I said, I want to do something different. Like, everybody buys a $2,000 suit and sit and brag about it. I said, I want to rap with my favorite rap group, right. which was Fushnickens at Fushnickens. the time. Right? So I did it on our Arsenio Hall show. Shout out to Fushnickens. Shout Chico. out to so I did on our, our senior hall show. My agent called me and said, man, you ain't going to believe this. I said, well, he said, Jive offered you $10 million for three albums. And I'm like, "That's." I'm like, bro, $10 million? $10 million. Like, I never wanted to be a rapper. never wanted to do an album. You know, for me, just meeting you guys is right. a pleasure. Because right. even though I'm Shaq, I'm right. still a kid. Right, that's fine. Like, you remember when you first came yeah, out, yeah. who was the first yeah, one to call yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yeah, I ain't going to lie. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like you were, you played one game uh, and, and I'm just sitting there watching it and then you, at the end of the game you, the, 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 the announcer just asked you said something and he goes my name's Shaq but only fam call me Poppy you know what I'm saying yeah. oh shit I said like, Shaq is crazy yeah, yeah. I'm sitting there I started sweating the whole room everyone just stopped and looked and said did Shaq just say your rhyme on live TV I, so but you I, so when you and Damien Litter right what, what was your dispute? He was saying that he was the best. Or what, what, what was it? Wasn't a dispute. Uh, it was fun for me. Okay. Okay. Because I felt like a rapper. I, I, I was in a battle. Mm. Dame's a Dame's a fine fella. Right. Great rapper, great right. player, but you know how we are with our egos. Mm-hmm. You can't say you're the best when I'm around. Right. You can't say you're Superman when I'm around. Right. Right. But it's nothing personal. Right. right. Okay, you say you're the best, watch this. You right. drop one, you drop two. It was fun. Right. You know, we, we talk all the time. You know, we, you know, we had a great time. And I wish real MCs could be like that. Right. Like a man, right. you got beef. Yeah. We yeah. call and talk. Yeah. Hey, my wife all in, my kids all yeah. in, say whatever you want. Yeah. And you say, and then we just go back and leave forth. Leave it on the mic, like leave yeah, it on just, the court, yeah, right? leave it on the mic. So when I was becoming, when I got that album deal, I was like, I don't want to be a rapper, but I want to rap with all my favorite rap artists. So it makes me the best. Like I said, it's my discography. Because it was rumored. F- Fushnickens. Mm-hmm. Red Man, yes. Wow. Eric Sermon, yep. uh-huh. Fat Joe, uh-huh. Big Pun, uh-huh. Michael Jackson, uh-huh. Quincy Jones, uh-huh. uh, Nas, uh-huh. Lord Tariq, uh-huh. Notorious B.I.G., uh-huh. Jay-Z, uh-huh. Ice Cube, uh-huh. Snoop Dogg, uh-huh. and a lot of underground rappers. Uh-huh. Peter Guns, Corey Guns, uh-huh. Cannabis. Uh-huh. That's your boy, Cannabis, uh-huh. eh? <laughs> <laughs> That's your boy, Cannabis. Let's drink to that. Let's drink to that. Q, be real. You know it was, this is what I'm drinking? It, it was, don't ask. I asked yeah, you what yeah, you're yeah, don't, don't worry it about was it. Rumored, it was rumored that you had the ah, first I can't record. hear you. <laughs> <laughs> That's a real idea. Yeah, it, was, wow. it was rumored you had the first record with Nas, Jay-Z, and Big. Yes. Like on the same record together. Yeah. 
So why did that record didn't come out like that? Because when it came out, what was it J and Big? You you know how it is. Like yeah. the clearance. But, te- but tell the people, tell that. the people that don't know how it is. The name of the record is, is No Love Loss. And it was you, Jay, Jay, Nas, Nas, Lord Tariq. Oh wow. And people people didn't clear. Look, I, I didn't I didn't take it personal because again, me being in the studio with Nas, I'm happy. Uh, all right. All right. I get uh, to call my boy and be like, hey, come over, Nas over. All right. You know, I get to call my boy and say, hey, Jay in here. All right. I get to call my boy and say, yo, Biggie at the house, we about to jump on the sea deuce. Mm-hmm. That's what it's all about. And mm-hmm. not to disrespect you guys, it mm-hmm. wasn't enough money in that for me. All right, yeah. Because I went platinum, right? All right. I did. So I was like, ooh, I went platinum. And they showed me the check. And I was like, this is some bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> no, sir, I was like, and then I learned uh, a valuable word, recoup. Recoup. Mm-hmm. So like I had to go in my thing. I was like, how y'all gonna charge me for studio? And I got my own studio. Yeah. Hold on, this ain't right. Yeah, yeah. So I got a few hundred thousand back, but I was like, so I, I, I really focus on just just going in there and having a good time with my favorite artists. Was that ever like a, a, a sidetrack? Because. Um, I, I, you know, Ron Artest is actually from Queensbridge. I'm from Left Frack, not too far away. And I remember Ron being fully distracted because he was really focused on his album. And we, like, people that's his friends that were associated to him was like, nah, bro, stay on the goddamn court. Did, 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 was that ever, like, cross your, your mind? Like, no, it didn't like, cross my mind. I, no, I, I, I knew I had to impress both worlds. Right. I don't think I just call up Redman Eric Sermon and said, I want to be a rapper. Like, they, they auditioned me, freestyle. Right. Mm. I have to freestyle. Okay. Mm-hmm. Freestyle again. Nah, that's written. That's written. Uh-huh. They don't give you five minutes. Like, so I, I had to, like, every every rapper that show up, I had to audition. Yeah, I had to, to send. Wow. I, had, I, had to, I had to do my part first, send it yeah. first, and they like, wow. okay, cool. But I realized Except for Big. That, you and Big was in the studio together, right? No. So, no. Yeah, yeah. So when, when I finally got the word that Big was going to do it, I did a verse. But I didn't like it. I did it because remember you ain't like it or Big ain't like it. No, no, I ain't like it because okay. remember the studio in my house, so okay. I wake up and nah, because because my thing is this is Big coming in. Right, right. One, I gotta impress Big because right. if Big say no, this is terrible. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> right. I won't get a second shot. So I did it. <laughs> Let my boys hear it. He ain't Bob his head. It ain't good. Mm-hmm. Let my boy hear it. He ain't like it. It ain't good. Let my boy hear it. And said that one tight. So okay, so Big flew down him and Lil C. So I'm nervous. Good. And you know, we go in the studio, him and Lil C's, he said, play it. So I played it, and he started doing this. Now I'm like, ah, so he like, okay, big dog, that's tight, that's tight. And then I said, okay, he likes it, so I'm gonna let him, you know, him and Lil C's do their thing. Uh-huh. So I said, here he, he you go, big. Pad the pen? No, 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 yeah, pad and pen. So he go hit the pad and pen, hit this button right here, I'm gonna be in the house. He said, no, nah, I'm ready right now. Yeah. I said, what you mean you ready right now? And he started smiling, and he went in there and he killed it. And the first verse, I'm the only one that got it, and I'll never play it. All right. He went off. All right. And I damn near had a tear in my eye because I had to press that button. I was like, uh, <laughs> big. He was like, yeah, yeah, for the kids, for the kids. My bad, Diesel. And then he did the verse that you heard in the thing. Oh, oh, oh damn. And you oh, got yeah. the verse. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Oh, but wow. I, I'm, I'm, I'm not going. I'm not going to play. Right, it. right, right, right. Um, what's your favorite era in hip hop? Our era. I can make some music. Let's drink it. Let's drink it. Is Diesel listening to this new music? He's got a drink. Oh, no, you got a drink. Oh, oh, no, yeah. Yeah. Uh, no, you didn't. No, you didn't. All right, I got to watch out. He drank him. Big dog. Watch out. Yeah. Uh, he got drunk with Patrick. But y'all almost, yo, but y'all almost got some weak drinks. Y'all ain't making that face. Ah. So, are you listening to this new generation? Or I try not to be the ones that... Because you don't remember, want to be the old guy. Not, not that, but okay. remember when we came out. Well, when y'all came out, yeah, yeah. everybody was on y'all too. Uh huh. Yeah. So I just try to, I just try to support the big guys. Just you know, try to teach them business. Okay. It's different. Right. Like, I don't really buy it, but when you're in the club and they play it, you like, like that right. uh, F F Negro Free song by the girls. F-F-F. Yeah, that should go hard. Oh, yeah. That yeah. should go hard. Yeah. You know, yeah, F R E. That shit. Hey, I was in the club the other day and I heard that. Let's go. Mm-hmm. Boom, boom, boom. I'm like, who is that? That, that shit go hard. Cause so, you a DJ too. Yeah, so you gotta know yeah, the new music. Yeah, so it, it go hard. So I, I try not, to, like you said, I try not to be the old guy. But I like our era. I like. 
I actually like the era before us. Okay, because 80s, of, the 80s. Yeah, the 80s, because it showed so, a lot of... This marquee era? Yeah, because I'm from, look, I'm from Jersey, so we started off with, you know, Graham, Matt the Fly, LL, uh -huh. Run DMC. Yeah. But then when I get down to Texas, you hear ghetto boys. Mm -hmm. And then when I go to LA, you hear Snoop and Dre yeah. and them. And then when I move down south, you hear Jermaine Dupri. So I like music as a whole, but I like I like our era because because it, it was the hardest. It, it was all about it's all about lyrics, lyrics and style. And everybody had a different style. Different, every right. region sounded right. like yeah. a different thing. Yeah, yeah. everybody right. had a different style. So let me ask you, in, in, in basketball, have you ever seen somebody that said, "Man, if I would play against him, he uh, uh, like he reminds you of you." Remind me of me? Yeah, did, did anybody remind you of you? <laughs> Never? Man, you gotta drink. That. <laughs> no, 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 yeah, nobody, because no, no. At one point, I Yo, know man, you, you ain't drinking, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. At one point, you, you, you might be mad at me for this. At one point, I did see, at the beginning, in the beginning of his career, I did see slight version of you in Dwight Howard. Yeah, he was nice. Later on, after you could take them. Yeah. So when he first came out, I thought he was, I thought he was a little bit better, more okay. more athletic. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm more hip hop and more street, but he's right. a little bit more. He could jump higher. Right. So a lot of times when I criticize these guys, I'm really giving them the answers to the test, but they mm -hmm. they don't know it. Right. Like I kept saying about Dwight, all you gotta do is average 28, 15. But you know these youngsters, their favorite thing to 15 say. 15 rebounds. Yeah. Okay. You know these youngsters, their favorite thing to say, oh you hating. Right. right. But why? I, I'm I'm like yo, if if you do what I tell you to do, you can be up there, but. Right. He never listened. Like I, I when when people criticize me, I can stop time. I can say, okay, is there any truth in that criticism? Like Shaq did. I as uh, a young man, you were thinking this way. Yes. Okay. Because my father's a drill sergeant, so I heard mm -hmm. it all. Everybody thought yeah. that's why you went to the general insurance because no. your father's the surgeon. Yeah, that was good. To know. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. You gotta drink to that. You gotta drink to that. Who stole my cup? Hey, I think I'm gonna cut you. All right, now. All right, now. Put these hands right. on the camera, man. Nora, you better get your boy out here. I'm gonna drink my drink. No, but he said you can stop time. So yeah. I can stop time, so Shaq did an album with Nori. Nori right. killed Shaq and album. Right. Let me stop for a sec. And I got kind of channel, Gene. Mm -hmm. that? Yeah, he killed me. Yeah, right. I can't say nothing. Right. Nah, mama, what happened? Like, like, he he killed me. Like they used to say, Shaq can be the best guy in the world, but he's not a, a, a great free throw, free throw shooter. Can't be mad at that. Right. That's facts, right? Yeah, we brought we brought a ball yeah, court. We want to see if you can hit some free throws right now at the first ring. Nah. <laughs> I, I ain't He's no gonna be drunk player. at that yeah. 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 Now, now when we started this, drink, no. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Ah. When we started this, we thought to ourselves because this wasn't like when, when when podcast first started, it was like for nerds. So when we started this, we was like we want to be like Shaq, Kenny, and Charles. Because and the reason guys, why Shaq, Kenny, and Charles is so respected is because you guys was in the locker rooms. You got rings. Kenny Smith got rings. He's from Left Rock City. And Charles, he got something like rings. You know what I'm saying? And, but y'all keep it real because when y'all critique another player, it comes from a level of love. How did that originally? Because was, was it Kenny, um, Charles, it was Kenny, Charles, and, and the other guy at first. Ernie. And then you got added on, correct? How did this, how did this no, chemistry it was, start? It, it was Kenny and Ernie first. Okay. Then Charles got added on. Then I got added on. Look, they already had a great show. Why? Right. So the first year I came there, I was trying to be on my professional Brian Gumble. Right. It was terrible. So right. the producer TK pulled me to the side and said, "We ain't bringing you here for that shit. Oh, yeah. shit. We want you to be Shaq." It was like, "Oh, you want me to be me?" Right. So you know, once once I started doing what I do, you know, the show became better. But but Ernie, Ernie, Ernie's the guy. My man, like, yeah, 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 Ernie, yeah, yeah. Ernie, Ernie's the guy. But we. You guys respect the show because you know Shaq was a bad motherfucker. Right. Barkley was bad. Right. Kenny got two rings. Yeah. So we, we He's a bad motherfucker too. I'm yeah, not gonna let you know. He got two rings yeah. on the Knicks. No, no, yeah. no, he bad, but I ain't gonna drink to that. No, <laughs> <laughs> no so what you smoking, man? No, 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 the cigarette. Let me see. It's the cigarette, yeah. No, 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 no. Yours, let me this see. This one, alright, cool. It's called cigarette. One more role model, man. Oh, okay, no, 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 don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Don't worry, don't worry. It's out, it's out, it's out, don't worry. Hey, I'm gonna drink it Oh, but hold on, it was a cigarette? Yeah, this oh, is a cigarette. Oh, my bad, my okay, bad, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, it's a cigar, it's a cigar. No disrespect, no disrespect, yeah, 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 y
you, we, we said about Papa John's. Did we speak about Five Guys? Because we got Five Guys. Did we get so, that right? I used to own a whole bunch of Five Guys, but I sold them. So now I started a, a fast casual that's called Big Chicken. Big chicken. Big, big, big chicken. chicken. Big chicken. Big chicken. Big chicken. Big chicken. So we started off in Vegas and we just sold 250 locations. So oh, wow. Congrats. Pretty good. But no, that, no, you, so reason why like stuff ain't updated because I don't want it to seem I'm up here bragging all the time. Right. So I don't like, right. you know, one time I was on, I do this, I do this, and my mother didn't like that. So. Right. So a lot of times I don't really tell people what I'm doing. Right. Like who owns Muhammad Ali? Right. Who owns Muhammad who Ali? Who owns? Not Muhammad Ali. The yeah. estate? Yeah. His, his daughter. Who owns uh, Marilyn Monroe? Who yeah. owns Forever 21? You. Okay. Mm-hmm. Woo! That's a flaw. That? That's a flaw. I did you hear you talk about that. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. Owns who owns yeah. Reebok? <laughs> Woo! Mm. You own Reebok? I need a sneaker deal. <laughs> <laughs> so, but, you need drunk so like, sneakers. I don't, I don't like update that You need that to come stuff. out with drunk box. Because it ain't even about that for me. Right. You know, it's about a young kid who didn't have anything mm-hmm. and two people who weren't really that smart either. I'm not saying they weren't that smart, but they didn't have college degrees. They said, you can be anything you want. Right. And I was watching a program. Matter of fact, it was The Point Gods. Oh, NYC and, Point Gods. Yeah, NYC yeah. Point Gods. And yeah. they talk about how all the OGs protected... Yeah. Not in the hood. Same uh, for me. Yeah. When I was in New York, shout out to Mustafa and Wadu and Sultan. Right. I want to hang out with the boys. They're like, man, take your ass across the street. Go over there. Kenny yeah, Smith was a little older. Here. Kenny Smith was a little older right. than me, so I didn't get to see the, the drug dealers protect him, but I got to see the drug dealers personally protect Kenny right. Anderson. Like, Kenny Anderson used to come outside and they used to send him upstairs. This is it. Like, buy him yeah. an IC, get yeah. him some shit, yeah. and send him upstairs. Like, you cannot hang out. Like, and, I had, and I had two uncles that was cops, Uncle Jerome and Uncle Mike. They didn't right. play that, so they let them know. If I see y'all around Diesel, it's going to be some trouble. Yeah, so, both sides protected. Yeah, so right. it, was, it, it was it was all good, all love. And, and you were a cop in Miami-Dade County still, I right? was until you just blew my cover. <laughs> Oh damn, man! Now, blew my cover. now, how was how was it? Because I remember like us just betting on you just breaking these rims. Like, was there people that broke rims before you? I, I, Daryl Dawkins was the first one Darryl I saw. Dawkins. Okay. But this is why I started dunking because you see how the big men play now. Mm-hmm. Shooting jumpers, smooth. Mm-hmm. I started out like that. So one day in Texas, and only lost one game in high school in two years. So one day I, I got I got thirty nine and three. I'm working on my crossover. I lay a dude up, finger roll, and a miss. My father, this drill sergeant uniform, walks on the court during the game. Call the timeout. I was like, Yo, man, call the timeout. So call the timeout. Go outside. What are you doing? I said, Man, I'm working on my doctor. And before I can say Doctor J, he smacked the shit out of me. Whap. Ain't no Dr. J, B. Shaq. So from that point on, because I was mad at him, every time I dunk, I tried to tear the rim down. But what I noticed when I start dunking and kicking my legs, that everybody else would be scared. He's like, see, motherfucker, that's what I'm talking about. So that's when I saw, when I start dunking like that. You channeled that. I channeled right. that. Yeah, right. I channeled that. I mean, because, you know, his thing was play big, play strong. Because, like, I, I wanted to be the next Magic Johnson. It's like handles, crossover, yeah, doing all that stuff. Yeah, I see you trying to get your rock yeah, going, yeah. No, yeah. Not trying to get my rock <laughs> 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 yeah. yeah. What so, handles? Yeah, so I mean, I, I was playing like that, but once he, uh, once he taught me how to channel that energy, then you know it became something different. Because back then they was, they used to, that, that, that was the thing they should say, big men don't have a handle. Yes. You know what I mean? So and so you you I, did, I think yeah you were like one of the uh, no no I, I was the first to, yes, to yes, uh, yes. go coast to coast. Skip the my Lou and the bleach. Yes, so, so 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 Shaq, uh, I, this is one of the one of the most wonderful stories I've ever heard on the internet. Oh, you just got so sentimental. <laughs> you <laughs> said, said rolling in the elevator with Stevie Wonder. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I got yeah. somebody, somebody yeah. told me yeah. something. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Yeah. Hold on. Yeah. I want to hear the story. Okay, hold on. Because first of all, we lived in the same building okay. on Wilshire. All right, but all right. I just so, need to describe this story. He's by himself. Okay. Uh-huh. You can park in front, uh-huh. or you can park in the bottom. Uh huh. I'm already in the elevator. So you say Stevie got off his car, Dolo? No, no I, 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 I didn't see that, but he got, <laughs> but he got on the elevator, Dolo. Okay. 
And I'm standing in the corner. I see him. I don't want to say nothing. He's like, what up, Diesel? And he hit his button, and he got the floor, and I'm like... It's just me and him and him and him. Like he, you know, he came in. You know, first he came in, he, he looked and he was like, and I said, like, he nodded. He nodded. Yeah. He did like, no, no, he like, he did like this, and I was, you know, I'm just in the corner, man. I'm gonna be in his way. He's like, what up, Diesel? And I was like, and then I didn't say nothing. Then I called my boy, and they gave me the same reaction that y'all gave me. That's all good. Yo, no, that's one of my favorite stories. No, but somebody on Twitter was like, well, he pressed the button because there's Braille on the buttons. That, that was someone on Twitter was saying. Right. That. The elevators have and we wouldn't, it, we wouldn't you know if it is because. That's being polite. Yeah, we wouldn't know, right? Yeah, how how do you know it? it's, it's Shaq? That's the yeah. whole thing. I, I believe Shaq, man. I believe Shaq. No, I absolutely believe Shaq. I'm trying to make sense of it. I'm telling you, Stevie can see. A little. So I've been spreading the rumor outright. Let me take you listen. Who said he was driving? Someone said he was driving. I might have said, I might have said, I might have fabricated it on Shaq's story and said, Shaq seen him driving. I might have made him the driving part, but the story's still the same. Stevie Wonder can see. A little bit. The other, the other scared. A little bit. <laughs> nah, a little bit. So Five Guys, he used to own, so we taking the Five Guys burger <laughs> off. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. So, <laughs> and, then, and then we messed up because we told them no, Papa John's no, and they ordered Popeyes. This is how you know we got Bozo's <laughs> working for working with us. <laughs> <laughs> we ordered Papa John's Popeyes. and they ordered Popeyes. Hey, I ain't gonna lie to them Popeyes biscuits. <laughs> <laughs> Did you have the Popeye sandwich where everyone was going? Because no. it had cocaine in it. You know that, right? <laughs> Allegedly. Just drink to that. You know, I don't think you should drink to that, Jack. <laughs> ah. Allegedly. Allegedly. So. How my eyes look. Do, 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 you good? <laughs> do, do, do what, look what, like what, I've been dragging. No. Okay. <laughs> what part do you miss about basketball? Or do you miss Nothing. basketball? You don't miss no. basketball? Good answer. No, because growing up, I, I watched all the karate movies. You know how the karate movies start? And, one of the guys who talk like this? I did that one time, I got in trouble. <laughs> wow. I did, so. Where did you do that? You got in trouble. I'm going to answer a question, then I'm going to get to the story. <laughs> okay. So, you don't re miss remember, remember growing up, like when, we, when you first watched karate movies, the karate master is so crazy, nobody can get yeah. to him. Right. That's how it was for me. Like, I used to love Ewan, and now I get to face him. Right. I used to love Jordan. Now I used to get to face him. Right. I got to try to beat him. I got to try to beat Barkley. Right. So for me, it was about beating these legends. Mm -hmm. I don't really see nobody that, that that's going okay. that's going to make me you know get crazy for that. Now back to the story. Okay. So when Yao Ming was cut, because you know me, I don't really pay attention to nobody because yeah. I know what I'm gonna do to you. Right. right. So I don't really pay attention. So it's like this dude's coming. So I got on TV and I was like, Yao Ming. <laughs> you want to battle the great Shaq Fu? <laughs> well, I will see you Sunday <laughs> on ABC. Yeah, oh, yeah. They was like, oh. and I said, listen, I don't care what y'all say. Well, I grow up at, that's how I go to a book. But you know what? I had to bring a movie in to show him. I said, no, 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 I'm not making fun. What, he got offended? No, no, he no, didn't, but you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. there was cancel culture they before cancel culture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They was trying like, to cancel oh, you before yeah, cancel culture. Yeah, I said, no, 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 no. Every Saturday, right. every Saturday from 8 to 12, I'd be up watching Nori. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a gun strategy. From strategy. What? So, so, yo, I had to bring like a tape and be like, so there was an all oh, but I said, okay, I, I won't. I won't ever do it again. Oh man! And well, you yeah, don't man. miss basketball. Nah. You don't cuddle on the cuddle. Are because you, you know why you into the game? That's, that's like us. What would you know, say? I, I, I'm saying you said like cuddle. No. <laughs> no that's because you, you watch. You, we watch the game. Oh, you critique well, the game. No, 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 like, 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 do you miss DJ? Let me ask you that. I, I do. You do. But that I, era, I can't tell. the era that I DJ <laughs> from is not the same right now. Yeah, it's not. Because he like I'm from the crate digging era. Yeah. So you ain't carrying no crates yet. I used to in college. In college? So, so with the DJ thing, like when you don't do something, people think you can't do it. Right. So I started then. My first, I had two SP 1200s and a Gemini mixer. I started with a Gemini that's mixer. That's how I started. I started with the Gemini. Right. I started B Street was my first album. Uh, rough, rough, yeah, like yeah. going back and forth and scratching. Really the one is a fresh. Like you know, I started doing all that. Yeah. Then I got away from it with the uh, when I started rapping. But then I was dating this girl and she took me to this EDM concert. Mm -hmm. It was a half a million people out there yep. jamming. So I'm, I'm like, man, this is nice. But then I'm reading an article one day, them DJs make $50 million. Make that, right? I'm tapping into some of that. Yeah. <laughs> so oh, you'd be like this oh, at yeah. the EDM so, party? Yes, hey, yes. So, like so, so when I first came in, they put me in the celebrity DJ thing. Like, cool. Like, they didn't know what I could do. Like, they didn't know I was a real DJ. So I had, the whole year I was doing BS clubs and 
BS pool party, but now I'm doing I'm doing like hundred fifty thousand. Wow. Stadium. But so, to yeah. be clear, you practiced before you started going on Bro, stage. I've been DJ since '88. Right. But I'm saying for those EDM parties. Well, the, that's easy because you're just you know putting right, stuff right. together. But like you know, when we DJ, like we DJ hours, you gotta, hours every day. But you got to still read the crowd. Of course, right. you yeah. got to read the crowd. Yep. So you know, like a lot of these guys already have their sets in. So like I'm coming in and be like, I'm gonna start with this. Oh, with the EDM. I'm gonna start with this, yeah. Yeah, but yeah. you ain't got the. You, all you got to do is go like this. The EDM show. <laughs> like I did they a all show. Ecstasy. And hop straight up and down. Yeah, they all on ecstasy. They don't really care. I did a show, Lala Palooza. Lala Palooza. Can I get Jack Beasley to do a DJ set? When I do EDM and dub set, y'all don't like the stuff that I'm doing. I'm not doing EDM. No, no, no. But, but what makes my thing special because I put a lot of hip hop in there. Mm. So like hip hop. Dubstep is dope. Dubstep yeah. is dope. What's so, dubstep? So, oh, no. du so it's, dubstep. It's out of England. Right? So dubstep is similar to hip hop, and okay. and in the sense and that reggae too as well. And, like and the sense that the BPM is the same, 75, mm -hmm. 80, 90. Mm -hmm. So I do a lot of like popular hip hop songs. Like I like I, I got the top, double now, open up, shot like uh -huh. the DMA. Everybody oh. know that. And then I did. And the they hard beats. Dubstep are yeah, hard yeah, beats. Yeah, hard beats. And then you know my boy. Yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. We're gonna, we gonna try. Yeah, we gonna try. Nah, he'll kill it. He'll kill it. Yeah, we're gonna try to get back. So look, we got a game to be played on on this all the time. It's called Quick Time or Slide, right? We usually play it with a drinking game, but what we could do is we could have Sunny D, who we call your little, we call him Baby him? Shaq. We call him Baby Shaq. He look you know like Sunny D. <laughs> <laughs> Shaq, I don't baby like Shaq. Shaq. Telling so, me I look like Shaq. So nah, I'm saying, so every time you put it together, he'll take a shot for you. So we'll take these shots, but he'll take a shot for you. What do you mean? He's drinking. Yeah, okay. He's drinking, drinking that agua diente. Ah, ah, good one. All right. You want agua diente? You want agua diente? That's fire water. It's Spanish. Oh, you speak Spanish? That's Cuban, B. Me llamo El Padrino Negro. Oh, you speak Spanish? Yeah, you speak Spanish. Yeah, you speak Spanish. Right, you ready? Right. Yo, cause, um, for this one, hey, Lee, I'm gonna on, need you to help me out. I'm gonna do Japanese. I'm one. big in Casa de Campos. Yeah. Yeah. Casa, de Casa de Campos? Casa de, um, Dominican Republic. As oh, that, soon as I get off the ball, this is Casa de Campos. Break, mama, yeah, yeah, don't fall for that, though. As soon as I get off the ball, Papi, I'm about to do what you want. No mas, no mas, mama, no mas, no mas. Papi, dame beso, no mas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dame beso, no, 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 no mas, no mas. All right, let's roll. Oh, okay. Can yeah, I put my drink up there? Let's get my shot ready. Can I get my shot ready? Can I put my drink up there? Yeah, yeah. Put your drink. Put your drink. Yeah, I want the answer. Y'all want to know what I've been drinking? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I can lie. That's and right. we do own this. And, and that's what's up. We're yeah. going to support that from put now on. Put it right down the camera. I was, how did me walk in here with some Fiji? Hey. What is my problem? What is my problem? What's his name? Who, Rasta? With the Dread? He got a new name, Draymond Brown. Draymond Brown. So remember, if, if you if you ask them both, be politically Best correct, life. then he drinks for you. So he drinks for you. So you ain't got to drink, but we drink with him. We ain't gonna leave him out there. I like ain't that. no punk. Okay, good. Cool. <laughs> drink it. All right, you ready? Yeah. Tupac or DMX? Tupac. Okay. Hold up, but do you have a Tupac story? No, I don't have a Tupac story. No story. Okay. You never I, met Tupac? I would see him all the time. Wow. And I saw him one time in my jersey, but he had a lot of people around him. He just gave me the. I, I, I loved Tupac when he first came out. Right. Yeah, with Out of and Digital Underground, first no, couple albums after that. His album. Oh, you know what I'm saying? Beat. Right after. Yeah, 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 just. I like. I, Tupac I loved, Now. Yeah, 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 yeah that, yeah, that yeah. album. Yeah. And I would see him, and our thing is hip hop and athletes. We all have respect for each other because yep. we all going through the same thing. So I will see him a lot, and he just give me this. Same with Nipsey. Like I oh. never went. Like I wish I could just shake his hands, see what's up. But they would always just give me, and I would, you know, always give them that. So I mean, right. so I, I like him. I, however, Dmx was very nice to me. One time we, we I, I threw a party for Dmx, and it was poorly promoted. It was thirty people there. That man performed for an hour. Mm -hmm. That man mm -hmm. performed for an hour for me. So and he gave it his all. Yeah. Yeah. It might be Shaq because every Can time. Can I answer both? <coughs> yeah, if you ask yeah, both, we drink. We drink. Oh yeah, drink. All right, all right, cool. Yeah, both. Because you know what, it, you know what yeah, it is, both. Shaq too. Because I, I experienced this with you as well. Um, because sometimes we be giving people. Can I get a regular shot glass? Yeah, give me that. No, 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 no. Let me see that glass. All right, I'll drink the big glass. 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 No, no, hold on, hold on. Shout out to my boy Matumbo. No, 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 no. Drink, man. 
No, 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 drinks. Hold on, hold on. Hey, and after you leave, if I see you driving, I'm going to put them things on. You're about to send your county, man. That's the time that I believe. That's the time that I believe. So that's it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The first years of Mess Shack is what Shack used to do. And I don't know if you did it on purpose or if you know what you was doing. Shaq used to come up to you and just go, he just grabbed your whole head. You just go. Yo, I ain't gonna lie, he did it to me a couple times. That's because. I'm going with this man. That's because I love you. Yeah, I know, I know. And you helped me become me. That's why I got that mix of noise that. No, 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 real talk. Music calms me down and gets me hyped. Nah, that's real. Living in LA. Death Row had me on fire. Mm. Wow. Going to the game, yeah. you know, snooping and they just, cause, cause they was hard. Right. And I had to be hard. So music, I just love, like, like again, I'm- So you know I'm the Crip Walk? I do, but I'm not a Crip. Okay, so yeah. I, I know how to do it, but- Kylie Bell ain't a Crip, yeah, she Crip yeah. Walk over oh, here too. Yeah, 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 to California love. To California love. Yeah, I'm not gonna do it, he said yeah. a little bit. So, but I, yeah. okay. I uh, love you guys, I appreciate yeah. you guys. And you know, the problem with some of us is when we get to a certain level, we don't still show love. I'm gonna right. always show love to yeah, all you guys. Yeah. So I'm like, I don't look like. I, I I forgot what rapper said it, but everybody eat B. Yeah, like everybody eat. Yes. Like there's a whole bunch of money right here. I'm gonna get mine, but I want you to get your. Yes. Like, I, like what's that? If this room was money, I don't want it all. Right. I want Draymond Brown to get something. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like you know, I, I just hey. So everybody eat. So mm. so the reason why I grab you and bring your head to my heart because you close to my heart. Mm. I love you, and I've always loved you. Nah, I'm not, I'm, same yep. here, Jack. You make some noise for that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. okay. So, you want to go to the next one? Yeah, yeah. Scarface or Ice Cube? Ooh. Both. Oh, shit. Don't oh, uh, worry, you didn't hear yeah. me. Cause, cause you, no, because you know why? I'm going to tell you why. A lot of times when clips get put out, right, depends on how they cut them. And I know both the gentlemen's. Never wanted to seem like I'm being disrespectful. I know them both. It's actually really a hard pick. Like, I, I've been knowing Brad for a long time. When I first met Brad in Houston, he, he, took, me around, yeah, he yeah. took me around. Ice Cube has been nothing but nice to me, so I don't want to go him and then they, you guys, not you guys, but your editors put it out like, right. Shaq chooses. Like, oh, no, no, so. we, don't, we, don't we don't do clickbait. We don't do clickbait. We don't do clickbait. But we're going to drink today. I don't know what you do. We're going to drink today. Hold on, hold on. No, 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 let me see it. No, let me see it. We don't do big shots, Shaq. No, 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 not this time. No, no, no. shot. No, This is a shot. This is that deli. Yo, you understand. This is ah. that. <laughs> we didn't take lots of shots of that afterwards. Mm. But you never drank cat? You used to drink before? I do drink. You do drink? But not in public. Okay. Because I can't do nothing to jeopardize my mother's empire. That's wow. That's so I'm not going to sit here and say I don't drink. Me and my father used to drink after all the championship games. What's your drink of choice uh, when you uh, drink? Patron. Patron? Patron. So if I'm at the house, I'll drink. But I'm not going to drink at a restaurant and jump in the car. and then Because, you know, my father always used to tell me, if you mess the money up, your mama ain't going to have no house. Mm -hmm. If you mess the money up, your mama ain't going to eat. Mm -hmm. You the one. God has chosen you to get this family out of Brick City. Uh, you. So if you mess up, so I don't. I, I drink at the crib, but I'm not going. Yeah. I'm not going to drink on the show. Okay. I am going to drink on the show, but it's that. What? What? How you say it in Spanish? Aguardiente. 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 Slow down, man. That's not Aguardiente. <laughs> no, no. That's his Aguardiente. That's, not, that's, no, that's no, Jack's no, Aguardiente. This is Aguilana Aguardiente. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. What, what you How you say eighty eight Spanish? Would you ever get into owning like a a, a, a a company? Because I'm on it right now. I don't oh. want to talk about, it, but I'm on it. Oh really? Yeah, I'm on a, it. A, a tequila company. I'm on it, man. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, on today's he episode, I'm so That's where all level I want to be at. We're like, yo, man, I got it. Don't worry about it. Uh, I'm on it. <laughs> all right, cool. Let's go to the next one. All right, um, you ready to eat? Yeah. Uh, okay, I got this one. Right. NWA or Wu Tang Clan? Wu Tang. Okay. Huh? I got this because I got the shirt on. Okay. ODB or Biz Marquee? ODB. Okay. Hold on. Yo, listen. Brooklyn Zoo was my joint. Yeah. Hold on, because I hear they filming. Nas and them filming a documentary about Biz Markie. 
I was on the phone with him for a half an hour yesterday. He didn't even bring it up. I was so pissed off. You know Bismarck is one of my favorite yeah, rappers. Yeah. I oh, gotta yeah. Yeah. He was nice. I gotta be on I wanted to play nice. Bismarck. When I first like lost weight and they was saying that they was doing the juice crew thing, I came to audition and I told him I would gain the weight back just to just to be biz. Right. Word, yeah, I love biz. And he was the first to me. Biz was the first person to bring comedy into rap. Yeah, like yeah, hip hop was like too serious at that time. Yeah. And Biz was the first person that made me laugh and 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 party at the and same time. And he was hella talented too. And hella talented. Yeah. Ooh, Penny Hardaway or Kyrie Irving. Penny Hardaway, stop it. Ooh. Stop it. No explanation. He just stop just move on. My face is the explanation. <laughs> I think he's feeling that. Real, Akalina Eddie Hayes. No, I Akalina Eddie Hayes. I'm about to show that too. Yeah. Wrong. Ready? Yeah, you go. You had this one. Red Man and Method Man. Red Man, Brick City. Right. Ooh. But I'm going to say both because Method, because, you know, they, I, I did an album with, uh, what was that album I did? No Hooks. Right. And, and Method Man has always been, like, again, I'm the shag, but. You guys have been my favorite rapper, so when I call, they answer. Right. We break bread. I'm gonna do both. But Red Man is from my hood. He's family. So we saying both. Yeah, both. We're saying yep. Both. Brick City. <laughs> what, what, what was that, Sonny? <laughs> <laughs> That's diesel size. Cause you know, I gotta be ready. I gotta be ready for your. Okay. Hey, okay. It's your boy, yeah. My, <laughs> Michael Clark Duncan. Look at me. <laughs> Thank you for that. He needs to be put in his place. I stepped it up. Okay. Last track, I Okay. Because I ain't trying to get y'all locked up. New Jersey Drive or Juice? New Jersey Drive. Okay. Juice was cold, though, wasn't it? Juice was cold. Juice, yeah. Queen Latifah or MC Light? Queen Latifah from Queen the Brick City. He going to Jersey all day. All day. Oh, all day. Uh, this one, this one, I don't know where you're going to go with this one. Mm. This one might be a little different. Big Daddy Kane or Rakim? I'll go with Big Daddy. Both. Okay. <laughs> both. Salud. Cheers, cheers. Oh, you got to drink your oh, yeah, Acalina 88. Mm. Say that again? I like that right there. <laughs> Acalina 88. <laughs> it does sound it does. It does. It does. You should bottle it and it look like liquor bottle. Let's do a commercial right quick. I'm gonna look at the camera and say, Mama say that I drink, and then you do it in your Spanish voice. No, no, no. No, no, no. You gotta do it like the Kung Fu movie. That's what I'm saying. Mama say, hold on. You gotta run to the commercial. Ready? Here we go. Mama say that I drink. Acalino 88. <laughs> if you don't get your fill from the Fresh Prince, Daddy looking like that. Fresh Prince, Daddy looking like that. Y'all crazy. Yeah. Right, okay. Okay. I sent you a text and told you this is going to be the best show you ever had. Oh, yo, man. Oh, man. Here we are, man. Who are you texting? Right, come on, no. <laughs> Who we at? You ready? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm trying to switch it. L.O.Q.J. Oh, yeah. and KRS-1. Oh, yeah. L.O.Q.J. and KRS-1. Both. Oh, all right, cool. Yeah, that's what it was. Both. Can you, can you get the shot for me? Thank you. Thank you, Logan. What happened to the girls, man? We don't, we don't like that. We need to have a Who told us that? Who told us that we have a, a bottle boy? A bottle boy. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on, you got the next oh, one? Oh, don't you look like the dude from Breaking? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, shout out to the dude. <laughs> 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 Yo, 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 Y
<laughs> Rest in peace, Shabba Doo. Hey, he's as old as that, too. Yeah. <laughs> the next one you want me to do? Uh, Yo MTV Raps or Rap City? Huh? Yo MTV Raps or Rap City? Rap City. <coughs> In the basement. The basement. Okay. okay. Mm. Hey, take the next one. E. And I was on the basement, by the way. Uh, B Street and Crush Groove. I was actually in B Street. For real? Wow, that's all. Awesome. I'm gonna show you the clip. Okay. I know y'all ain't gonna believe me. I'm, I'm gonna show you the clip. No, we believe. Yeah. Oh, I know he was in B Street. Out. <laughs> 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 that's good you got it? Alonzo Morning or Dwight Howard? Alonzo. Ooh. Oh, yeah, go to the next one. All right, MJ or Prince? You was dating Janet at one point, right? Who? Oh, you? No, never. <laughs> never. We. Uh, Where'd you get that one from? I just gotta throw it out there. <laughs> no, she. Uh, she actually, she actually at ninety five when, when I was with my girlfriend, I actually got in trouble. When I was with my girlfriend. She had a show in Orlando, and she called me on stage. We seen it? the clip recently. Yes. Was it, was it was that? Yeah. 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 I got. It. She was grinding on it. She was grinding that thing. Yeah. Penny from Good Times. Damn. Grinding that thing on the yard. Yeah. When you say so, it like that, it's crazy. Come on. Yeah. 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 So, no, we all love Penny. I love that. Take it back. MJ showed up at my house and tried to buy my house in Orlando. In Orlando. Just, no. he just, yeah. He just showed up at the door. He just showed up. Yeah. He need two way you. No. no real estate agent. Just, no. Mm-hmm. He just banged some dudes. Hey man, Michael. Did he have the glove on? No, you don't have the glove on. <laughs> so I had this big 70,000 square foot house and I had a bed that fits 50 people. He looked around the house. He's like, I'm, I want to buy the house. I was like, it's not for sale. And then I went to his house. This, this dude had a real zoo at his house. Yeah, in Orlando. He had a carnival, like a whole house. Yeah. What are you talking about? Never no, okay. Not animals. This dude had a real zoo. He had a zoo. Ferris wheel in, right. in that bitch. <laughs> yeah, and everything. So I'm going to go with both on that one. Okay. Wait, but he said you, you had a bed that fit 50 people? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I missed yeah, that. I didn't know how to. I don't. I didn't even know how to answer that. Yeah, yeah, I don't even know what that means. Yeah, yeah. You should have never sold that crib. Oh, I still got the bed. You still what? Oh, he took I the. I still got the bed. Oh, okay, you, you still, still got the bed. Land on tour or no? Nah, I sold oh, no, he it. Sold okay. that. Yeah, I sold it. He said he still got the bed. Oh, All right, Sonny, don't be so excited. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but he still got the bed. No, the bed was the bed. That's a legend. Yeah, I, don't, I don't mind you saying that. I don't mind you saying that. Just put some bass in your voice. Yeah, that's all. You said you're mad trouble right now. Hey, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm just saying. This is stuff. Oh, this, oh, this is a good one because this is Jersey both ways. Lords of the Underground and Naughty by Nature. Both. Oh, nah, nah, Naughty by Nature. Trench. Okay. Man, you took it back. Yeah, Trench. 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 Trench is one of the illest. Uh, whoa, to do whoa, whoa. That Chief Rocker was. Ooh. Like, yeah, yeah, man. Mm. Yeah, both. Mm. Both. Yeah, <laughs> both. I'm sorry. You, 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 hey, take a shot. So, okay. Uh, 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 oh, I'm in. You too. You too. Oh, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> What's the name of this shit again? Uh, Acalino 88. Uh, that shit does sound like something I want to drink. Yeah, I'm on. <laughs> But we're, 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 okay, all right, come on. All right, I'm gonna go back to that. You're so right I got all the big dough. Good. Yo, you drank it. How does it replenish itself? I just he pour quit it in. Oh, okay. I got this. Hmm. Okay. Pat Riley or Phil Jackson? Phil Jackson. No explanation needed. Well, I won three with with, with Phil. Let's make some noise. Yeah. 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 MCN or DJ? Oh, you skipped it. You skipped it. Oh, that's you, a good one. Yeah, that's, that's that's for you. All right, go ahead. So let's do it. No, you go back. MCN or DJ? DJ. Really? Yeah. I didn't think that. I thought you were sure. I'm gonna take a shot for just thinking wrong. Because <laughs> that, that energy you get now. from that crowd when you yeah, it's good. Because you know, it's only so people ask me why I DJ. It's the only thing that reminds me of a game seven. Wow. Yeah, it's, it's that's deep. That's deep. It's, it's, it's a drug. Song. It's a drug. That's, that energy is you a drug. You know what's crazy? When people ask me about this, this is the only thing that, when, when we, we drop an episode, it's the only thing that reminds me of going platinum. It's the only thing. You went platinum? Oh. Drink to that. <laughs> Drink to that. You have way too much Acalino yeah. Chetio. No, no, I didn't know. I got, I got one platinum. Well, I'm in R.E. I was platinum. I got four gold albums. Yes, well, I do. Bro. Well, I've been out I here for a long time. Bro, bro, I don't bro, know. I, bro, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> I was the first one to recognize. I know that's you, right, that's I, right. I never knew you went platinum. That's, that's right, that's, that's right. 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 I'm saying you went platinum a little bit. I'm going to see you just cause. It wasn't off rip. You went platinum. No, no, no. It wasn't off rip. Right. It took a while to go platinum. But it was, yeah, it was that year. Hey, platinum is platinum. Platinum is platinum. Absolutely. That's good. Miami or LA? Miami. That's right. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Miami. Okay. Oh, damn. 
Where we at? Where you at? Yeah, yeah, exactly. New Jack City or King of New York? New Jack City. Nino Brown. Yep. Yeah, get the next one. The Source or Double XL? Source. Because they gave me three and a half mics. I thought I was the shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it was hard to get those mics. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Mike. Oh, speaking of uh, if the source is out now, the game album will get five mics. Wow. Game album crazy. I didn't get to hear it yet. Right? I, only, I only heard the, the one he shouted me out. And, um, he said Dream Champs too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. it's crazy. Yeah. Uh, oh, it's crazy. okay. And hold on. Y- y'all need to start showing Pusha T a little bit more respect. Oh, yeah, no, yeah, we, yeah. We, we, no, 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 not y'all. No, no, he's saying I'm talking yeah. to the world. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pusha T, crazy. Nah, he crazy. Oh, boy. He crazy. Yeah. Okay. Man. Michael Jordan or LeBron James? Michael Jordan. Kobe Bryant or Dwayne Wade? Kobe Bryant. You don't get your Ja Morant looking ass about here? <laughs> <laughs> Come on out here so they can see you. That's my side. 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 That's my Loyalty. This is the last one. Everyone thinks this is a trick question. Good, because I got a piss drinking all this. Okay, yeah. Hold on, hold on. Good, because I got a piss drinking all this. Acalina 88. Okay, because everyone thinks it's a trick question, it's really not. Loyalty or respect? Loyalty. Mm-hmm. Because when you're boys, you don't have to respect each other's decision. Right, that's real. Like my best friend told me, don't bring the water because y'all had the water. Uh huh. Like, they ain't got the water. Uh huh. But so we did. Yep, yeah, so, you know, I kind of. So I kind of disrespected him, but not not believing him, but I'm gonna always be loyal to him no matter God what. Damn, that, that was you know, great. we argue and fight all the time, but the loyalty is always there. Goddamn, that was a great for yeah. I'm taking a shot to that even more. I ain't taking yeah, a shot. I got to okay, pee yeah, like a mother. Yeah, yeah. We wait for you coming back. Come on, let's go. I'm taking a shot to that for. Hold on, I'm going to just pee right here in this cup. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that would be a first. That's, that pee. <laughs> Trading cards, like NFT trading cards. Oh. Yeah, man. Yeah, this Frenchie, everybody. Frenchie! Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I feel the, like he like damn near a slumdog billionaire, because somehow this nigga knows everybody. Everybody. Yes, I'm ready. Uh, Goddamn it! Oh, we 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 feel. Oh, we oh, we, 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 we don't we don't stop. We don't stop. So so Shaq, Yo, man. who is who is more competitive in your opinion? You want me to drink? I'll drink for no reason. No, no. Worries. <laughs> okay. Who is more competitive in your nature? I mean, well, Kobe or or, or, or Jordan? Because the, I don't. Well, you 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 played against them both. Yeah, you see Jordan, and you can see the competitive, but Kobe was a different animal. Right. Like, I used to see Kobe dribble and shoot without no ball for an hour. <laughs> oh, like shadow boxing? Like, yeah, like shadow yeah. boxing. Wow. Yeah. Was and, then, and then go out there and do the same move. Wow. Yeah, Kobe. Me and Kobe had similar attitudes. Like, right. Kobe wanted to be the best ever. Right. I wanted to just be the best at killing you. Right. Because I, I was never the guy that's, oh, he's the best big man. I want to be the most dominant big man. When I walk in, I want people changing rules. People scared, people going like they this. Did. I mean, but Kobe was like, I want to be the best ever. And like, he used to practice four or five hours a day. I'm not doing that. Because my attitude was, why am I practicing four or five hours for you? Right. Who are you? Right. I already know what I got to do. Right. I just bought my mama a new house, and she got to keep it. And you ain't going to take that away from me. Right. So, you know, it was a lot of, oh, Shaq didn't work out hard enough. But no, nah, I, I know what I got to do. It's all you right there. Drive. Yeah, it's, right. it's all right there. Because, um, like they say, like 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 Kobe was, like it was just all about the win for Kobe. Like yeah, like, it was. But then, but then you look at Jordan's story, and they say that it's all about that. But then, the one critique that everyone says about LeBron James is they they always say that he didn't have the killer instinct. So I have a question for the panel. Yes. 
win win. He needs he needs to average sixteen points uh, this year to pass up Kareem Abdul Jabbar. Come on, uh, LeBron. Yeah. yeah. So if he pass up the great Kareem Abdul Jabbar in points, does that make him the best player ever? No. All right. So hold on. Okay. No, you say no. So if somebody is better than me and I pass them up, are they really better than me? Just asking. And I love these conversations. I really right. do. I like you know? That's actually a great you know, conversation. That, that, I can't. I, and I, I think I, like I have the so, correct answer I think different for people you. have different answers depending like on some so people who see it just on stats. Okay, because how can you how can you say you got the dopest yacht when he pulled up in a yacht 200 more feet than you? Right. Is your yacht really the job? I know you got a helicopter pad and all that, but this shit, four floors. Five. So it's bigger don't mean better. Mm-hmm. You sure about that? Yeah. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm, I'm just asking. Cause, no, I'm, I'm, I mean, because you know, we, if you don't have killer instinct, how you get 38,000 points? Yes, right. sir. I'm, I'm just right. asking. Right. Just asking. Right. So, I'm, I mean, I'm, I can't wait to hear all the experts and hear what they you, say you about that. You know what's that. the crazy shit is? Jordan, Jordan is the best ever. To me, to me it happens like that. This, yeah. You were being my ass. We're like direct. Direct. <laughs> <laughs> to, to, me, to me, Dr. J is the best ever. The best ever. Because because he started it, and then you know came, came Magic, and then Mike. So I think when we have these conversations, we need to go by eras. Right? Definitely by eras. Gotta go yeah. by eras. Because but if it wasn't before, gotta, there's no. I got a different best ever ever to. What? To me, LeBron. I mean, excuse me. To me, the reason why Jordan is the best ever is because he won. He never really lost. Yeah, he has 6-0 in the finals. Right. That's right. That's, but the reason why, the truth for me, I like people who go through adversity, and I think LeBron is the best ever because I really believe that stuff that LeBron does, Jordan cannot physically do. They're two different sizes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen. Hey, listen. Shaq don't have his own thing. Hold on. Shaq, I got on Jordan's You're now. Big. I got on Jordan's now. I'm, I'm, with, I'm with Team Jim J. But what I'm saying is, LeBron, like, for me, for me, for me, I love the, 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 the you know, the assist game. The rebound game, uh, the scoring points. He he can he you know he doesn't mind letting someone else, someone else score while what, he's assist. Whatever the case may be. And that's what I like about these conversations because they can go all day. Right. They can yeah, go, they all go all day. day. Everyone can make different points. They can different go all day. Because if LeBron was about points, he could score thousand. I'm, I'm gonna tell you something that LeBron has always been. Joe, answer my question. What? When that man passed up Kareem, is he yeah. the best ever? Yeah. Listen, I ain't gonna lie to you. I love LeBron. Like me personally, I think LeBron is our version of Jordan. He is because I think I think this year this was my first time like being disappointed, but I didn't not making the playoffs because I just want people to know. And I always said this. You can go on my Instagram. I always mm-hmm. said I'm a New York Laker fan. Yes. And I always <laughs> because I always I said that. Because I always, I and by the way, by the way, I, I get yeah. killed for it. By the way, I get I got killed for rooting for you. For years, like, I used yeah, to have a Shaq jersey on. Yeah, this was like, yo, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I used to have a Shaq jersey on. Yeah, this yeah, was like, you're guy. from New York. New York, so I'm like, I just, I just love Showtime. Who's from, the most? From Showtime to y'all shit, I was just like, I just couldn't, I couldn't stop fucking with the Lakers. Now, did I adapt the LA lifestyle? I didn't do all that, but I was, fuck, and, and I had never seen that. Like when you and Kobe had that run, like. Yeah, it was like unprecedented. Yeah. How do you say unprecedented. it? Unprecedented. 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 <laughs> <laughs> it's that, that unprecedented. Who, who's, unprecedented. The, who's, the most, who's the most dominant big man? Oh, the most dominant big man yeah. ever. I, I, I know him personally. Yeah. I know him personally. Yeah. No, but who, who else? Chad. Bill Russell. And who else? My Bill. My Mountain. And, uh, and, and Will. Oh, and Will. I mean, yeah. And Will Will. So, Will. so yeah. you know, when people say those three names, I don't mind, but. If I would have passed up Will Chamberlain in points, I would have came on and said, nope, me. Yeah. Only because right. I passed him up in points, Chan, and all that, me. Correct. And, and I don't want to hear nobody else's name. Right. But he got more points, so 
you know, when you say that's the end all be all. That's what I'm saying. So right, like, right, I wanna, right. Like, to, some, to certain people's standards. No, but really, no, really, the, the, everybody the, the, the standard. That is the standard. Every, the stats, everybody, the stats, everybody, the stats. everybody look at stats. Numbers. Everybody look at the rings. Right. I mean, points about this and that. And it's the so, only thing that everybody right. could agree on. That's what I'm is, saying. Is so. I, but, 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 let me just be, let me just be honest, let's be clear. It's like, we have the same conversation in hip hop. And a lot of people, you know, always give it to like a Drake or such and such. But people always say, whoever got the most money is the GOAT. Yeah, but hip, that's hip hop. Yeah, but, 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 if you got the accolades. I don't think that makes sense. No, though. hold on, let me finish. If you have the accolades the that matches the money, that's why there's no one that could that's definitively right. say Jay Z is not the GOAT. Mm-hmm. Right. It's because one, he has all the accolades to prove it. And then two, he has all the other accolades to prove it. He has the big house, he has the, the big. How can you not money. say he's the GOAT? The you know what I'm saying? How can you not? Like, yeah. what his wife is, you know what I mean? And yeah, I, I, right. I hate saying that. I hate saying his wife because it ta- to me it takes away from, from who him. he actually from is. Him. Like yeah. he was that guy. And she deserves her own. And, and her she deserves her own. Right, yes. Right. Yeah, but um. You know why? Because you can't break my thumb. You, you can't break my thumb. 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 What? Because who we drinking again? Jack, who we drinking again? Akalina Pachentio Cho. And, and, look, and that's why hip hop and basketball is like you can have these conversations. Who's right. the best? Who the, who the artist? Who the, right. you know? So I well, love I, it. Alan Iverson, what was what what what, 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 what was y'all relationship like? He was a dog. He was he's probably one of the only guys I couldn't punk. Like if I block a shot, like most guys when you, I block their shot, they won't come back in. He come in every time. <laughs> and he actually, I'm, I'm upset at him because he messed up history. Wow. Because the year that we were 14 and one, I wanted to go six. I, I was so mad and upset. I wanted to go 16 and zero because there was some other stuff going on with some monies, and I was like, okay, I'm about to show y'all that I slash we the best Laker team ever. Because right. I get tired of hearing that what Laker team is better. So I said, I'm about mm. to prove it to you. Right. And like, if we would have went 16 and zero, I can both we can mostly say, okay, Magic and Kareem ain't go 16 and zero. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like that. Uh-huh. So we underestimated him that first game, and I think he hit us for 51. Yeah, for 51. The one where he stepped over Derek Fisher. Yeah, that yeah, one. Yeah, that one. He, he hit for, um, yeah. But, I mean, but you know, we still went 15 and one, but I wanted to go 16 and 0 in that so final. So you said, as small Playoffs. as Al AI was, you would come, he would mop this shit. Yeah, he was. And he would yeah. still come back in. Yeah, he still come Only back. little man that ever did that. Only little man that ever did that. No Muggsy Bowles, none at all. He's a dog. Jordan was like that, too. Yeah, yeah Jordan was like that, that. Like, So Jordan, so I, I've only, I, I can, Proudly say I only been dumped on three times in 20 years. Three and three times. times. Jordan, Derek Coleman, and a dude named Tim Perry. I got a lot of dunk buys, but I'm talking chest to chest. The, right. Only time you got three. posterized. This is yeah. Yeah. Three, yeah. Yeah. Three, three times. It's a poster three times. somewhere of Michael Jordan like that. I don't know if it's a poster, out. but he got me three times. So, <laughs> so next time he came through, I had to lay him out. But when I laid him out, I laid him out. I went to help him up. He said. Don't ever help nobody out. That's what he said. Cause you know he's also my fraternity brother. Oh, Shout wow. out to Omega Psi Phi Q yeah. Dog. So yeah. I laid him out. I'm like, you're not dunking me again. He's like, ah, I need. And I said, yeah, my my bad dog. He was like, don't ever help nobody up. So like he taught me a lot. <laughs> and then so we beat them. And the next year they came back and swept us. And he put his hand on my shoulder and said, before you succeed, you must first learn to fail. And I didn't know what that mean. I was like, so I'm all summer, me and Alex riding around, I'm pissed. I'm like, and then I finally sat down and like, before you succeed, you must first learn to fail. And I thought about it, I was like, yeah. And I, you know, we had to fail a few more times. They said, you know, for us, when we get tired of failing, that's when we persevere, you know, do something else. Yeah, but why do you think out. he told you not to, to give him the hand up? Because he knew I was a bad guy. Because <laughs> I was the last one to, to beat him. And I know people are going to say, well, he, you know, he wasn't ready when he came back in 45, but there's only one guy that sent him home in the playoffs. That's me. Right. So, but, like, he, he he knew that. He knew I was coming. And yeah. he said, but, you know, the things I was going to do is the things he went through playing Detroit and, you know, all the greats go through it. And I was ready, but I wasn't ready. Because the year we made it to the finals, like, you know, we, we, we played Houston and I kind of let down. And Akeem was my, was one of my favorite guys and, you know, you're supposed to show a person that you're competing against, you show them respect by showing them none. 
Yeah. And I respect sh- by showing them showing none. Showing them none. But I, showed them, but I showed them too much respect. And he averaged 31, I averaged 28, but they swept us. And, but it also taught me a valuable lesson. If I ever get back to the finals again, I'm going to put on a performance that's so crazy that it's going to guarantee us a win. Okay. So God <clears throat> comes to you and says, you got one last game to play. And it's either with Kobe, LeBron, or Jordan. Kobe. Because when you have when you have friends right. and you have discrepancies, but they're not really discrepancies, right. you should always reach out to that friend. I work. Right. I work twenty one hours a day. And I was always the guy like, me and you been boys how long? 20-something years. How many times have I called you? Be honest. Uh, I don't remember. None. None. <laughs> no, That's no, my no. point. Yeah. That ain't right. Right. At least a text, uh, shout out, right. DM, something. Yes. And I've, uh, and it hit me hard as that year because mm. before Kobe passed away, my sister passed away. Oh, God. And I was always the, I'll call her tomorrow. Right. Let me go about this business. I'll call you tomorrow. I'll call you tomorrow. I call you tomorrow, and then you wake up and, and they're not they're not here. Right. So that, and so if I could just see him one last time, and we just argue, right. fight, play, I, w- I would love to have that. So so to so all the people out there, if you had you know discrepancy with somebody, but yep. you still love me, care out, about him, reach out. Reach out. Right. You, ain't, you ain't gotta see him, you ain't gotta hug him and kiss him, but just send a text. Right. Right. What's happening? Because what, what what was the initial problem that there you wasn't a no problem you, at all? What you what started it? Like it was, was it? it was not he didn't pass the ball because that was the rumor that Kobe no, didn't pass the ball. Shit. Yeah, just you know you got two guys Dominate. on the same team, so it's not a problem. Like some of my favorite stories involve Kobe. No, no, some of my favorite stories to watch are. You didn't know that the Brady Bunch had beef. Right, right. Like, you know, stories like that. Like, cheers. Yeah, yeah, cheers. Cheers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. But, but, I call them Norm and them niggas supposed to get along. Yeah, but the, but the moral of the story is if you got two alpha males, you're alpha always going to bump heads. Right. Like me and my boy, we bump heads all the time. We've been friends for 20 years. Right. But the respect is still there. Right. right. You know, but and so that was the beginning of the the internet and all that stuff. So if I say something and he say something, now everybody, ooh, they don't it's like each other. It's amplified and it's all Yeah, right. but yeah. no. I was in charge, yeah. right? He had his little click on the team. I had my little click on my team. But the respect was always big. We, we, we ain't got to get along. He want to shoot. I'm saying, nah, pass me the ball. I said, no, nah, I want to shoot. And, you know, we had our little spots. But that's been going on since Little League. Yeah. But I always tell people, the story y'all talking about would be better if we have no championships. Damn. Like, we, bro, we got, bro we, got, we got three in a row. And... I, I want y'all to look at this clip after the show. Yes. First championship, we win, I put my hands up. It's 30,000 motherfuckers on the floor. Who the first dude to jump in my arms? Go. 30,000. Mm-hmm. But we got beef. No, right. we ain't got beef. We got we got disagreements. Right. You know, it's like, if, if I seen him with his family, I ain't going tip or drink over. Hello, Miss Vanessa. Hi, baby. This is Uncle Shad. Like, it's, but, right. yo, you he's, argue. He's I, got, too. I, got, I got a little brother. We argue. Right. We fight. You know, I got my favorite Uncle Jerome. We argue. We fight. But the respect was always there. The respect. And then, when I got traded, that was a business thing. You know, you, you keep the old guy and you pay him money or you start all over with the new guy. And I understood it was business, so I, you know, I, I wasn't really tripping. So, a lot of people think we have problems. We didn't. And then again, I'm the type, I work. After I work, gotta go home with the family. I ain't got time to call you anyway. Mm-hmm. But I shouldn't be like that. I should be like at least, hey B. Shaw, hey Robert Ory, hey, hey Rick Fox. And, but I, I work and, and you know, when, when, when your friends are gone, you take it for oh, granted. Yeah, take yeah. it for granted, yeah. Because they don't do like reunions, like high school reunions. No. They don't do no. reunions for championship no. teams. No. They like, should. They, they should. should. They should. Yeah, should. I, how about like when people get late. inducted in the Hall of Fame? Do like, do, do they invite your old teammates? You can if you want to. So, oh. so for me, it was my family, my boys, my mom, the first guy that, that gave me a chance when I was in Germany. So, you know, if was Dale Brown was there, yeah, I was in Germany because I left North. Yeah, we left, right. we left Nork and moved to Germany. Germany. It was in a place called Hanau. 
in a place called. I like Dusseldorf. Yeah, D- Dusseldorf. I like Dusseldorf. Frankfurt. <laughs> what the yeah, fuck is Frank- so funny? He likes Frankfurt. What the fuck is that? Why is that funny? What the fuck? Take a drink that. for that, man. Take a drink for that, man. Take a drink. Take a drink, man. What's going on? Right. Shaq, when, when Kobe won the the fifth ring, oh, I was pissed. But he and he said it. That's what I'm asking. Yeah, because it's because look, it's and and you know what made us great is the competition thing. I'm looking at the stat. Oh, this motherfucker got 30, and I only got 19. Fuck that. Right? <laughs> but, but if you got two of the best guys in the league competing with each other on the same team, nobody can stop us. Right. right. And when we got to the finals, that's exactly what happened. So my thing was, if I don't get 28, 15, I'm not representing dominant big man. If, and uh, you know, Alex would tell you, if I come home and got 15 points, I'm tearing my house up. Tearing my house up. Because now I got to read Nori, my boy, say Shaq ain't shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like, like, you know, like, because cause, like, when you got people that love you and they keep it real, they say hurtful shit. Right. That's right. the truth. But, it but it's hurtful. They, you know yeah, yeah. I'm like, right. man, man, no, like, man, Shaq. Shaq losing it, man. Like, like, Shaq like, used to average 28, but now he ever feel like if I heard Nori say it, I got to hurt no, listen, me. But I'm not going to say nothing to Nori. But I heard, I'm just going to come out and get 50 in this game. You see ball players and Jay-Z be calling the niggas they oh, stats. No, no, like, he yo, does. yo, you listen. On Thursday, I was fucked up about you. <laughs> yeah, <he's> like, <laughs> like, yo, oh, you can't be telling niggas this. Oh, no, we, we, had, we, had, we, had, um, we, had, I can't say where we at, but I'm with Jay, and the whole Golden State Warriors come through. And so I'm looking, and they all kind of like walk past me. But then they like, we think that was Nori with Jay. So they all kind of like turn back around. And when they turn back around, Jay is giving all of them their stats. He's like, yo, bro, on Thursday night, you should have passed the ball to such and such. <laughs> such, and, such. <laughs> and they all like, oh shit, they all getting red in their face and moving. And then the next one comes, down to Steve, Kurt, what's this? Down to Steve, he's like, he's like, listen, let me just tell you something. You know why I fuck with you? Oh, yeah. And Steve Carr, he's, uh, what's his name? Steve, like, Kerr. Steve Kerr, my bad. He's sitting there so red in his face. And Jay goes, because when Jordan said, are you going to be ready when I send you the ball? And he's like, he's sitting there, his face is so red. Because he's like, how the fuck does Jay-Z remember when he, he's not talking about him as a coach. Right. He's talking about him as playing. And I'm sitting there like, oh, shit, I forgot he used to play with Jordan. And uh, it was crazy, like, how so, never not so yeah, people really be knowing the, 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 the stats. <laughs> He drunk. Yeah. <laughs> no, hold on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He drunk with Shaq. You drunk with Shaq. Hey, don't try to dance with Shaq like you no, 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 no. Don't try to dance with Shaq like Patty LaBelle. No, 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 no. You already went to be in his 50. You already went to be in his 50 guys back. I'm talking to him. gave a great story. <laughs> but where his story was at. Where's Shaq? <laughs> <laughs> I'm baby Shaq. You can't do me like that. 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 You can't do no, I kid you not. He he looked at all the Golden State Warriors. They all came through, and he told them what each one of them or what they did. And I'm like, how the fuck you seen the game? We were right here. <laughs> we were right here together. Sure so, that. Let's go. He wants to give you that. I can lend you ten thousand. You want me to drink it? You want me to drink it? yourself out. I'm telling you, eat yourself out. Thanks, I'm not driving. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, but you and Kenny Anderson used to be neighbors in Beverly Hills. Take a shot for that. Yes. You and Kenny Anderson. Yeah. Used to be neighbors. And I used to hate Kenny Anderson coming to high school. Why? Because he hit you with that. Don't get that. I don't know. Yeah, he didn't know. You lost him in March Madness no, no. or something. Because all you New York guys was ranked ahead of me, and I don't know why. Mm. Ooh, Ooh, me, we were man, nice. Nah. Yeah, we were nice. And I wasn't. <laughs> you not a point guard. Oh, yeah, I don't need to be a point guard. I'm uh, Shaq. Give me Shaq. <laughs> <laughs> no, like I be. Yo, know, I used to be average 44, 20 in high school and be like. Number three. Number like Kenny <laughs> Anderson and Conrad McCray. McNasty, Conrad yeah, remember them? I'm like, damn. <laughs> New York has always ranked ahead of me. Because yeah, the yeah. credits don't know what they're talking about. I agree. It could be because of the competition of the teams that play too, then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you sure you didn't lose the Kenny Anderson? Yeah, yeah, Mars Magnus? I think you did lose oh, the Kenny Anderson. Yeah, I sure did. Yeah, come on, come on. Mars Magnus, you tried to try to the left rack twice. Yeah, I did. And then Kenny Smith in the NBA Finals. That's left rack twice. Big 2 0. Shout out to left rack. Shout out to left rack. Oh, my God. Yeah, 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 yeah.
Oh, left, right, but you be no. bullying Whoa. Kenny Smith on the show. No, I don't. You're just kind of, man. I bully everybody. You bully everybody? Yeah, <laughs> like, crazy things, like when Charles get me mad, like, my, y'all think I'm be playing, but my boys be like, nah, calm down. I be like, nah. And then motherfucker say, one more bench, I'm gonna knock his head. <laughs> He's he like, Shaq, relax. I'm like, all right, Kenny Charles. Good. No, because when you be telling, talking, bothering Charles about the ring, yeah. I think he's not finding it funny anymore. That's not, so, <laughs> again, people believe in stats, right? And right. championships. So when I say it's about the ring, my question is, how do you know? And that's what, like, you know, people have, have you know, problems with him. Yeah, he was a great player, but how do you know if you never went to that level? Like, yeah. like, for example, yeah. we could tell you how to go platinum. But if you I ain't never went platinum, right. how you gonna tell me how to go platinum? You know that experience? We can tell you how to rock a crowd. If you ain't never rock a crowd, how you gonna tell us right. how to you rock ain't never, I also heard you say one of the craziest, beautifulest things ever. You said that you wasn't the white man for your wife at that time. Yeah. And I, I've never heard a man admit that. Like so we all, a man's job is to protect, provide, and love. Yes. Right? But when you, and then like, what I'm about to say now is an excuse. I don't make excuses, but you know, when you have a lot going on, it's difficult. Right. And I didn't do what I was supposed to do. But I still love her, I still care for her, I still protect her. She's married now, and she's and you happy. you want her happy, that's crazy, that, that, that's I love it. that. No, yeah, you got me, because like when you say I do, it's really to make them happy, and she's happy now, so that, that's all that matters to me. Man. Really is, I don't, Man, that's, that's you know. beautiful, man. That is beautiful. That's beautiful, man. And and you're a great father, man. Let's, let's talk about that for a second, man. And, and, and you told your kids one of the beautifulest statements I've ever heard in life. You said, we not rich. I'm rich. <laughs> you said, I'm rich. Yeah. <laughs> I'm I'm rich. Just no <laughs> degrees, no cheese. That's right. Listen, Shaq. I, you want you want to go back to college? It's <laughs> over, fam. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hey, Sonny, Sonny, hold on. Sonny, hold on. I got I got someone on the line real quick. I wanted to bring on Chip Fu, Fushnikins. What's up, what's up, big dog? What's happening, bro? How are you? I love you, brother. You know they give me my. They give me my flies, I want to give you your flies because you're the one that got me started in this. I appreciate you, brother. Wow. Much respect. You, I, I love you. All right, how you doing? You doing all right? Doing great. All right, hey, this dude, listen, I used to spit a bar. He's like, no, go back in. No, go back in. No, go back in. No, go back in. Man, I'm like, yeah, man. He said, say, yo, man, you want the respect, you got to do it right. Go back in. All right, I like it like that one. So, so, yeah, no, it paid off. Appreciate you, boy. Much respect. Hey, this dude right here, drunk than I'm out. <laughs> Baby Shaq. Baby Shaq. Well, we're trying to Hold on, hold on. Let me say something to him. We're going to reach out to you. Okay. Dave Thompson. Dominic Thompson. Dominic Thompson. Dominic Thompson. All right, cool. No, you want to talk to him? I just got one thing to say to you. Last move, and we ain't got nothing to prove. Last move, and we ain't got nothing to prove. Last move, and we ain't got nothing to prove. Make some noise for Chip Fu. We know we need you on Big Chat, baby. Good looking out, bro. Good looking Peace. So, like, when I hit when I when I hit one of my friends, I said, um, I got Shaq on. He said, Yo, I was with Nichols one day from Far Rock, and he brought him to TNT. Nichols asked him some industry questions. He made a call. Nichols was meeting with K Slade that same week. Word is bomb. And there's so many stories like that of you like walking in malls and you going to basketball camps. I remember Kenny, I think it was Kenny Smith, basketball camp or something. You went and just bought all the kids sneakers. Show love. And show love. How do you develop that attitude and why do you do that? Because everybody eats. Yeah. If I see a Hispanic rapper that want to get in the business, I'm going to have him call you too. Right. And we give him the Acalino 88. No, do it again. Say it again. Say it again. Acalino 88. <laughs> <laughs> and see, because they, whoever they are, they stick together. The haters. No, just they. You know, just, just, just figure it out. They, they stick they. together. So, Quote unquote. Right. So if I could help somebody out, I can. And right. like, if I could, you know, and like, I always buy kids shoes. Like, it don't have to be my shoes. Right. Hey, what, what you want? You want some right. Jordan? You want some Jack? I get and I like when you say, right. don't take money from strangers after no, this. <laughs> no, no, sir, because that, no, I mean, that. that's the thing. Like, I don't want kids, yeah. I mean, because I mean, that's what those people do. Right. And, you know, that's the part of police I work. I work internet crimes against children. Mm. So I always tell kids, hey, don't let 
people just come and offer you money and That's offer you That's a good gifts. police officer. That yes. is a good police officer. They're all good police officers. Stop it. Most of them. Most of them. Okay, but 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 hold on. But but hold on. But, but hold on. So my thing is because I'm trying to bring police and the community back. Right. Yes. I always tell people. I said let's not let's not get sidetracked because. Yeah. If one rapper does something crazy, they look at Doesn't everybody mean crazy. All rappers are crazy. That's what I'm saying. Right, right, if one right, right. basketball player does something crazy, right. so you know, I think you know the individuals that do break the law should be handled. Mm -hmm. But you know, like I deal with a lot of sheriffs and a lot of teach. I mean, a lot of sheriffs and a lot of chiefs. They really do teach the right thing. But every now and then, you get somebody that gets out of line. So the ones that get out of line. Right. They should but it's be, the thin blue line thing that, that's is, the problem. Yeah, really. it is. Because the good ones won't do anything. Yeah. Really. So, 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 um, tomorrow we're supposed to, uh, to uh, this week we're supposed to have Derek Jeter. So I went and I looked at Derek Jeter's documentary. And one thing about Derek Jeter's documentary was, that was unanimous, was, um, they, they pointed out the fact that the racial, the racial, you know, um, the racial issues that he was addressing. And then it made me think about, like, you know, Jordan and, and, and like, Jordan never really addressing the racial issues until... George Floyd. And then, you know, everyone actually, who, who we actually wanted to say things back in the days, actually stepped up from Derek Jeter to, to Jordan. I'm more of a, I'm more of a do than say. Yeah, okay. I like, like the if action, something, right? yeah, I like the action. If something goes right. down, I have the power and ability to go Ooh. to the police station and be like, what was that about? Right. What was this about? So, you know, like, uh, you know, my thing is, if you haven't been doing it, don't start grabbing your phone and doing it now if you don't mean it. Right. So like I'm 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 more of a doer. I don't I don't call and say, hey man, somebody need to go buy those kids toys. I go do it myself. Mm -hmm. I don't call them people and say, hey man, somebody need to go into that hood right. and tell them boys to stop shooting. I go by myself. Right. Like y'all need to cut that out. Right. They watching y'all. Y'all over here tripping. What are y'all doing? Do it. You know I've, I've I've done it in every city that I've I've lived in. I respect the guys that speak out, but. I'm more of a doer. No, that's a beautiful thing. No, he's always been about that life. Right. So, always stepping. Hold on. I might slur a little bit. A little bit. It's no statement. What the fuck? That's what you get, my friend. Say We blame it, Shaq. It's number love. He wants to be a spokesperson. Shaq is always stepping. Hold on. 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 I'm agreeing with him. Yes, we agree with him too, sir. But, 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 all right, so now you had this illustrious deal with Reebok, right? It's rumored that you said that these sneakers are too expensive. No, I didn't say that. I was, I was leaving the practice one day and this lady with her baby, shack, 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 shack. But the mama wasn't smiling. And she's mm. like, and she went off, you mama, and just crying about the price. And I stopped and I thought about it, I was like, she right. And she was right. these the pump Reeboks or? Yeah, they, yeah, all of them. They, okay, my, cool. they were like two, two something. Cause, like cause, almost 300. Because everybody trying to compete with Mike. That was the business. So I'm, I'm sitting there, I was like, yeah, she right. And, and then I, and I called Reebok and I said, I'm, I'm going to start my own brand. And then we, we did a deal with Walmart. And since then, the I first said, year, Reebok was actually making those sneakers for you, right? Yeah, yeah. I but I the, but yeah. then I had something carved out where I can do my own thing on the side. So we we, we uh, started the, the Dunk Man. Yep. Mm -hmm. dunk yeah, man. the Dunk Man. You so the, You were like this. That's me. The yeah, the air, yeah. like you said. So you know where I got that from, right? Jordan, right? Yeah, Jordan did the jump man because that's how he dunk. And I was like, dunk. you know what? I'm, I'm going to do Dunk yeah, Man. It's working. It's working. Yeah, it's working. Yeah. So since 95 when we did that, we, we probably sold over about 400 million pairs. That's awesome. Excuse me, excuse me, sir. What'd you say? 400 million. 95. And what, what did you end up pricing it down to? 15 bucks 39, right now. No, 39 and below. Right. So so where, where we come from, it's not that we don't like cheap stuff. We don't like stuff that look cheap. Right. So I, I get too. so I get designers and, and, and I... And to be straight, you created a business, I'm sure, I mean, you will answer this, that you still made money selling it at a lower price. So if you invest in things that's gonna change people's lives, you always get the return on your money. For me, that, that wasn't a money thing. That to me, that was more of a statement thing. Like, big town guys could be down here with us too. Mm -hmm. Cause like, sometimes when we get big town, we wanna go upstairs. <coughs> so Walmart and Target, those are considered, considered the downstairs market. So 
I wanted to just, you know. Yeah, the Target too? I thought it was just Walmart. Yeah, Walmart. Walmart no, all over. Walmart, Target. Oh, the big box. Yeah. Target yeah. sell kids? Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. I wanted. I don't go in that section. Yeah, yeah. have you sold. Have you sold more Shaq's than Jordan's? No. Not even close. No, no Jordan is the god of selling shoes. Yeah. He's, uh, that's why he's a billionaire. But, you know, again, the, that that play was about taking care of the babies. Because I remember I, I, I remember when Jordan first came out, I cut grass, walked dogs, yep. washed dishes, oh, tried yeah. to get a job at McDonald's. Yeah. And then by the time I could get, get to $200, the 13s, my old size dogs. 15, I still put Shit, them on anyway. Died yeah, you know, I, I put them on anyway, and that's why my toes messed up now. So that, that's, that's funny to, um, to hear you say that because I, I, then you had to face this guy. How is that? Like, you saving up money. So, first time I played, I was terrified. Was he nice to you? As, that's your idol? No, it's just that's Jordan, bro. <laughs> right, right. That's what it was. The yeah, idol. Like, you know, the like, like it's because high school college I never got dunked on, but I was like, this dude could probably dunk on me right now in the <laughs> basement. I think he's sweating but, magic. But, <laughs> so when he first came and did a little stutter move and he shot a shot, I was right there. So now I was like, uh oh. <laughs> like, because I was like, he's a god, but I'm like, I'm close to the god. So, so after I got almost blocked the shot, all that, all and that went away. Him? Yes, right. and humanizing. And then, you know, same thing with you and you, like in the garden. You know, you got to show up in the garden. So, you know, when I get to the garden, <clears throat> it's like, nice to meet you, Mr. Yo, and put your hand up. Uh -huh. Nice to meet you, Mr. Yo, and Pat, no, no, put it like this, and Pat him like this. Shut your ass up, rookie. Oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Hey, that's my next question. Yeah, oh, that's so, that's so, that's so, now I'm like, so now I'm like, it like that. I'm like. You know you done fucked up, right? <laughs> yeah, so so now, because I was like, man, it's Pat. But then when he did that, I'm like, bro, you trying to punk me in front of my family right now? I, bro, I, I know we in New York, but Jersey right over there, too. I said, okay. And then, you know, same thing with him. So, you know, first game, he got me. But, like, you know, on, on that turnaround, I'm right there. I said, okay, I'm going to go home and watch this tape and see what I got to do. And the next game we played him, you know, I blocked his turnaround. So, so like, so once I blocked his turnaround, I knew I had him. That's funny because that was my very next question was, everyone tells these stories. You have other NBA, play, NBA players on here. They tell these stories about rookie hazing. I don't get hazed. I can't imagine no, someone trying to handle it. No, I can't imagine not someone hazing him. That's what I'm saying. Who the fuck is going to haze? I mean, I got to ask because every other so, NBA player. Shout out to Scott Skiles. He's like, he's like, carry my bags, rookie. I said, I'm not a rookie. I'm the franchise. <laughs> Was Dennis Scott on the team when you went yeah, to Atlanta? He's yes. my boy. Yes, he was. Dennis was so like, you know, um, Dennis was like, yo. Because there's rumors of like people making people nah, pay for dinners. Nah, I ain't do none of that. You ain't do none no, of that. No, man, I'm, I'm Diesel. <laughs> nah, so, D Scott would say, hey, man, just carry the bags because we, you know, just play the game. I said, I'll play the game with you, but I ain't carrying. I ain't, I'm not no bag carrier. Because, uh -huh. you know, my thing is, make me carry your bags. Mm. You whoop my ass, I'll carry your bags. So, I'm, I'm like, I'm like the big guy with a big guy mentality. I know you could probably fight, but in my mind, I'm not gonna let no little guy with so right. so everybody little to me. They like, carry my ain't carrying no back. So you know, once I start playing and you know everything start coming, then they show me a little more respect. But no, nah, I, I didn't get hazed. You didn't get hazed at all. Nah, never. But you saw it though. You saw people get hazed. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> That's real. Is there anybody in the WNBA that could beat Shaq Diesel on one on one right no now? Way. No, never. Right now. No. Cheryl Swoops can't. No. He, he taking a shot to that. No, man. <laughs> no. No. Since, since, since Noy brought up WNBA, what do you have to say about um, Brittany Grant and what she's going through? I smoke mad weed in Russia. Just throw that out there. <laughs> Me. It's, I was there with you. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's, it's unfortunate. Yeah. yeah. They doing it to the U.S. to make a thing for the U.S. Thing it happened at the same, around the same time. It's yeah. unfortunate, and I wish... Mr. Biden would do a little more to get her out. And that, that's all I can say on that. I, I have a solution for the WNBA. So, I don't know if you know, in, in, in males beach volleyball and women's beach volleyball, the net is lowered just a little bit. That's what? Only, it's net lowered. 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 The net is lowered. So the only thing missing from the WNBA to, in, to, to the NBA game is the dunk. So imagine, I'm not saying lower it to nine feet. Just eight so feet, they can dunk. So they can dunk. It's yeah, more so, of a show. Uh, There's a few that dunk, but not, but not but, consistently. But, but, uh, they get more of, more of that. 
not, not, not uh, just, just a little bit. So I think if they did that, it'd make the game more exciting. Because look, they got the handles, they got the shooters, they got the showmanship. They just don't have the dunk. And so just imagine that. So if you lower the, the rim just a little bit. So they could, they, well, you're, you're, you're dunk man. Yeah, they they could, well, no, you're right. Yeah, you're right yeah, about that. Dunk. This for me, for real? Yeah, yeah, this for yeah. You, for yeah. You. No, those are golden-plated golden roses, for real. But why wasn't you on the 92 Dream Team? There was rumors that you was down with Pepsi and, and it was a Coca-Cola team. No, so Christian Leitner. Christian Leitner. He had a better college career than me. He won that previous year. Yeah, they because they, cause they, they won championships. That's yeah. the dude from Duke, he right? Was, yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he yeah. wasn't was the best the player rumors. coming out of college. No, he was on the yeah, he, but But he had a... He had a better career, and I like again. Sometimes you have to sit down and just be honest. I'm the best player; I should be on the team. But then I don't want to be on the team anyway if I ain't gonna play, yeah. right? So, but so he had a better career. So I said, okay, but you still keep it here, and it just drives you. So now I have to ensure that I'm the first pick, mm. right? I have to. So I, I was just you know doing a lot. So I, I, I went that whole summer and just played with Magic Johnson, and just learned the and learned the NBA game, because because it's a different game. It really is. When you seen that clip with MJ and Magic Johnson, where MJ said, get, get your sneakers, let's do it right now. I felt like y'all niggas never leave the game. No, we don't. <laughs> I was we like, don't. yo, and that's I why, looked. And that's why when we criticize these young players, we always got to, well, I would have did this, and I would have right. did that. It's, that's yeah, it's, it's, just, it's just what we do. Like, I wish I was playing now. Shout out, shout out to LeBron. He just shined that, that two-year 97 extension. Dame got two years, 120. Oh, man, That's I wish right. I was playing right now. Uh, and and that keeps me young. But you man, say you don't I miss it, though. I don't miss it, but I wish I was playing. Bro, two. At, at that level, at that no, level. Playing period, no, playing no, period. Cause, I mean, because this, I mean, this is cause this is how I, cause this is how I always did my contract. If you're averaging less than me and doing less than me, but you're getting paid more than me, that was perfect. Right, right. I was like, oh, he, he got this? So now I'm going like, yo, if you paid him this, what you going to get me? Right. So right. with me being Shaq, I'm, I'm not saying I'm better than those guys, but right. with me being Shaq, if, if it, you know, you're getting 120 and you get 99, I'm going to be up there too for two yeah. years. Oh, man. The most I made was 120 for seven, which was a lot of money at the time. But 120 for two? A lot of money oh at the time. It's a lot of money now. Yeah, yeah. It's, 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 it's a lot of money right now. I just yeah, said so I got 120. A lot, <laughs> a lot of money back then. Right. What do you mean, Jack? Crazy. <laughs> That's why he said he got the platinum, the check for the for the regular. Like, eh. nah, yeah, I was like, really? Oh, bro, I, I was mad. He said, "Let's go to dinner." Bro, oh, I was mad. Oh, I was so mad. I was Better like, act some intelligent shit. You embarrassing us right now. No, he's not. No, you're not. Nah, let's let's, let's let him live. Let's let him live. Better redeem yourself. I want to talk about talk about it. Talk about it. The year. Because we're getting to Miami. <laughs> right, right. Yeah, yeah they're trying to just... Yep. Miami didn't know we could get Shaq. We didn't? And we got him. And it was Shaq, D-Wade. So that and was an accident. And we won. Yo, that was a great year. But you came with that 18 oh, foot wheel down oh, this oh, game Boulevard. Yeah. That was There's a great a year. Stuff. There's a lot of stuff that happened. Right. I want to talk about that year. So that was an accident because after we Do lost. The win. How's it an accident? I heard you say that before. How because we. Pat Riley was the Even ball. though me and Kobe had our problem. Get there. We're going to be forever. Right. I ain't leaving you. You ain't leaving me. But right. then my contract is coming up. You got to pay me. Mm. And then business wise, you're good, Shaq, but in four years you're going to be 35, 36. Do we want to pay you that much? Which is understandable. This is the bus family? Yeah, the bus family, which okay. is understandable. Like, one thing I understand is business. And growing up in the military, I'm used to moving every so four years anyway. Anyway. No, never. You can't. Business. Right. So then, after we lose, I don't even get a day to rest. I'm, I'm eating cereal with my son, and I'm watching ESPN because I want to hear what people are saying about me. So so I can add to, you know, what I got to do this summer. Shaq right. ain't shit. Shaq is just... So you know, watching cold some, pizza. Yeah, they yeah I'm, I'm watching, yeah. So yeah. then I said... Uh, Shaq will, uh, uh, the Lakers will, will take, will take, will, will, will listen for trades for Shaq. So I'm like, so now I'm mad because at least give me the respect and call me and say, hey, right. you know, we want to, you know, we want to change now. We want, you know, we want to give it up, but they didn't call me. So now I'm mad. So I called them and said, okay, because I couldn't do it by myself. I always, I, I got to have. Winning, like, winning. Yeah, like I got to have somebody with me. Man, I learned I that with like Penny. That. I learned that with Penny. It was my first guy that was mad, but couldn't do it, so I needed another guy. So right. 
I'm, I remember watching playoffs, and I remember D Wade giving it to Baron Davis. And Baron Davis is my guy. Right. But this D Wade cat down in Miami, he killing. But he ain't got nobody with him. Right. So now I'm saying, okay, if y'all gonna move me, that's where I'm going. Y'all, right, y'all just ain't gonna send me where I want to go. I'm going here. And then they say that Pat Riley was in the office talking to the Lakers before that. I don't know if he was trying to get the job or trying to get back to the Lakers, but they say he was there. So then they say after he left, they gave him a call and said, oh, hey, we want to move Shaq, and he wants to come down there. So they did the deal, and I was down there. But I saw in him a mixture of, of Penny and Kobe and D-Wade. So when I got down here, first conversation we had, all that stuff you heard about that, forget it. This your team. You the man. Uh, that's what D-Wade said. Oh, you no, said that's what D-Wade said. This your team. All right. <laughs> Because my thing is, I always got to be in charge. And some people don't like that, but I don't give a shit if you don't like it. It's mine, right? So with him, because I'm older anyway, I said, this your team, though. I'm going to show you how to win. I'm going to show you how to get certain things, but this your team. You need me, I'll be right there. So, so it wouldn't be no, because it was already his team. I didn't want to just come take it over. You don't really know me like that, so... It's your team, you so the man. You, you on the team right without you speaking to him? Right? No, when I came out here, we met on the came. beach. Oh, okay. I said, yo man, I'm here, meet me on the beach. You came. Would that be so hard? Huh? Would that be so hard? Nah, we met at uh, Mansion. Jesus. Mansion, Jesus. Club Mansion. mansion. So we sitting there and I told him, I said, yo, man, it's your team yeah. uh, and I come to win. Because, right. you know, and also criticism motivates me. And you had oh, three rings at that time. You had three, but right. man, you, know, yes. you know, criticism motivates me. Oh, he left Shaq. He ain't going to win again. Like, I, I, I need that. I don't, I don't get soft and get bitter and respond back. I'm like, okay. want to do more. Yeah, I want to do more. I and you knew you was gonna win. You knew it was gonna I happen. Knew it. Yeah, we actually could have won a year before that, but yeah, I had a thigh yeah. injury, mm -hmm. and you know we lost to Detroit in Game Seven. But I actually could have got two. So now you have one of the know. most liveliest, craziest performance I ever seen. You perform it, and then you just start going. Kobe, tell me how my ass tastes. I said, wait a minute. <laughs> that was a freestyle. <laughs> <laughs> you know how it is. Yes, yeah, so what happened? So Let's listen. Like, <laughs> different, there's a difference between a rapper and an MC. Okay. Right? Who's MCing that? I'm MCing. Okay. And, I got, and, and not only that, I was at a comedy club. Okay. And, right. people, and people expect that from you. Okay. And people was laughing. Everybody had a good time. That was viral, like, for viral back then. Yeah, it was viral. 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 It wasn't yeah. worth a viral back then, but, but niggas said, yeah, Kobe, Shaq asked Kobe, how's the ass taste? Niggas, this is viral. This is viral. Yeah, this but, but again, when you <laughs> cut it up and put it out. Right, right. <laughs> the click beat. Yeah, it was hey, freestyle. Again, and the crazy thing is, the reason why he didn't get mad because that's the same stuff we used to do on the bus. Right. right. We had bars. Right. Right. Like, we used to have battles on the bus. So, right. But, yeah. you know, like when you have people who think they know it all, they get in your bed, ooh, it ain't no ooh because I'm not going to get in trouble. Right. I'm not going to get in trouble. What's going to happen? I'm going to get a spanking? Spank me, though. <laughs> I don't know how this going to go. Hey, 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 Jack, you you know to have a great sense of humor. Yes. So how do you how do you go about doing the the Shaq roasting comedy or the Shaq and the Fool? Like how did that go together? So Shaq and the Fool is we want to we want to re <laughs> replace the word bloopers. Bloopers. Because ah, yeah, okay. remember back in the day everything yeah. was blooper. Oh yeah, yeah. bloopers. We want to get rid of that word and call everything Shaq and the Fool. And it's just look to make people laugh. Our show is also successful because they allow us to use humor. We all know sports, we all know stats, but you guys, you gotta work in the morning. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna keep you up late. We want you to enjoy what you're watching. We don't want you sitting there going like this mad because you saw a cr crappy game. We want you to see a crappy game and then see us, right. release that energy, mm -hmm. sleep with your wife, and you wake up and have a great day. We right. want we, we want to help people have a great day. Uh, what was the other question you asked me? No, Shaq oh, and Fool Shaq or the Y'all looking like, you know, <laughs> you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, So when I was watching Def Comedy Jam, yes, I felt so, like that. So comedy and music calms me. Right. No, right. I'm going to go crazy. Right. 
right? So if I can laugh, I'm good. If I can listen to the song, I'm good. Right. So when they stopped that, I saw an opportunity to do it. And we, we did it and, you know, it took off for a while. I'm thinking about bringing it back. Mm. Yeah, it was funny. It back. was funny. Yeah, we we need to laugh. So much tragedy yeah, happened in the world. Yeah, 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 we need much. to laugh. We need to laugh. Yeah, like, need to. I, I, we just had Dave Chappelle on. It's going to be released soon. But um, I remember I was having like a slight disagreement because he's saying, you know, it was it was like a mass shooting that happened. It was like, you know, I don't want to be celebrating while a mass shooting has happened. And I, I felt um, I felt the exact opposite. I was like, you know, the, 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 I feel your pain, but you know. Us in, the, uh, us in the PJs, when, when somebody gets shot, we don't stay home. We come outside the next day and still play double dutch. We come outside the next day and still play 21. And I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not trying to be insensitive to what's happening, but I'm also trying to tell you that's just the reality of what happens. Well, Sometimes from, yeah. we, 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 are so, we are so already hurt that a, a little bit of hurt ain't gonna stop us from... from, from and even the country like, as a whole. You can't take my soul. You can't break my soul, soul like this. Yeah. That's, 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 that's some black, that's some black human, poor, like like no matter what, like, you know, that's where chitlins came from. Chitlins and, and, and collard greens and all this shit came from is because we had the, the worst the of the worst, worst and the less yeah. of the less and we made the best of the best yeah. of it. And, and also, I always feel like that. And also in this world, we need to value the word respect more. Because yes. again, you and him got different opinions. That don't mean right. y'all got to be enemies yeah, now. Yeah, no, 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 no. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. So, no. you know, a lot of times, what? What? Yeah. What? And then it, it goes yeah. to somewhere it don't need to go. So I'm, I'm big on respect. Like, you don't always have to agree with me because I'm not the smartest guy. I'm not always right. But if you do disagree with me, I ain't going to try and fight you. Right. Just, right. Not know. everything's worth going that, that level. That, that's what right. I'm saying. Right. Yes. Right. I mean, but now it's, it's just, you know, going crazy. All right. We seen a clip the other day, right? Dennis Rodman bothering Alonzo Mourning. I thought it was the funniest shit in the world. He used to do that. <laughs> no, he used to do that. The clip I saw, Did it? Did Alonzo was... Mourning bit down and <laughs> Dennis Rodman were like this. All right, I, I, <laughs> Look at I, I, this I, I have a question. <laughs> Shaq, Kobe, and Dennis Rodman on the same team, who's the biggest superstar? You can say that. You, you, you ain't gonna hurt my feelings. Just say who biggest you think. Biggest superstar? Yeah, on that team. Shaq. Gotta be Shaq. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say, say Shaq. Dennis Rodman. That's He's the more colorful distraction. No. And that's what it is. He when is. When he played he with is. us, he's, I've seen this dude play a full game, don't take a shower, go to the club, and some of the baddest women I've uh. ever seen in my life. <laughs> <laughs> and they all go to his section. Yeah. No, no, no. I'm, 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 yeah, I'm not going to get away with no. that. Did you say he not took a shower? Did not take a shower. Okay, yeah. so he just... So he just this finished is the, the game just put on his gift. This was his, his routine. He smelled like Medusa, he said? This, <laughs> no, this is his routine. You can't bring his soul. You can't bring his soul. That's all. <laughs> this is his routine. So, game at 7.30, we got to be there at 6. He come in at 6.45, late for the meeting, eating chicken and rice. Yeah. Right? Take a cold shower while we talking. Then talk about going over game plan. Then come out and play. After the game, put his stuff on, go to the club. And the baddies come out. I'm talking about actors. Like, I ain't, I ain't never, listen, I'm the Shaq. I brought him out too. I ain't never seen nothing like this. And this was, and this was like after every home game. It was the craziest day I've ever seen in my life. Awesome. And you got me and Cole on the same team with him. But yeah, he, he, he has the correct answer. I ain't never seen nothing like that in my life. I'm talking man. We need Dennis Rodman. Yeah, yeah. yeah. How's your, how's your, um, I want to, I want to, I want to connect it to a Dennis Rodman thing. But after the game, you, pee? you said that you didn't practice because. Smiley Pippin. Smiley Pippin. What the fuck? I didn't even go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, I just, I just, I'm sorry. You came You said that when you were, you didn't practice because you knew what the mission was. Right. But after the game, how was your ethic after the game? And I say that because I, I finished the Kevin Garnett book. He made a comment that he played against Dennis hard. The game was hard. And then Dennis went and ran five miles after the game. No, like, he, that's, that's true. Is that? That's, that's a machine. true. That is a machine. But I, after the game, I had to go home. We got <laughs> kids, we got family. Right. And plus, I used to get beat up, so I didn't go home and 
chill and watch a movie so I, I could recuperate for the next day. But you know, this, everybody's different. Everybody prepares their own way. But I, after I after I give you my two and a half hours, I gotta take care of reality stuff. So right. I got a wife, I got kids, I got mom, and all my boys in the game, we go eat, so. But yeah, that, that's true. Like he used to do stuff like that. After the game, run five miles. That's true. And count in, in ten boots. In ten boots. That's okay. Yeah, that's true. And then did, go to the club. Did, did Did they ever get high in the locker room? You know, I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> we ain't Smith's camps. Yeah, I don't. I don't, hey, man, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Out, man. Yeah, hey, man. Um, <laughs> who was over here? Who was over here saying he smoked the whole time? Matt, Matt Barnes. Matt Barnes. Matt Barnes. Oh, Before he started his podcast, he was on here. And Matt is my guy, but I've never seen Matt do that, so I don't. Yeah. I but you know, say. weed is legal though. Nah, I'm, I ain't talking about weed. This is medicine. I, I mean, this is a cigarette. But I'm saying, yeah, the actual uh, mal, mal, uh, medical marijuana. Nah, you're different. Cause you know, uh, I got a, I got a, I got a, I got a, a license to to to, to burn. Let me mal. see it. Yeah, I got it. To burn marijuana. Let me see it. Yeah, he got the handcuffs. He got the handcuffs. Let me see it. Let me see it. Let me see it. I got a five nine five two 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 on twenty four East twenty third Street. Because at first everyone thought you was a firefighter. You nah. you didn't do that. You no did that. man. No. no. Sheriff. I swear to God, Sheriff. you did that too. Yeah, no. Miami but you also a doctor. Yes, I have a PhD. You a, but not a do- medical doctor. No, no, not a medical doctor. You a doctor, doctor like, like Dr. Dr. Dre? Yeah, no, no, Dr. Dre is what I was going to say. Come on, oh, 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 you a doctor like Dr. Dr. Dre? Oh, you a doctor. No, I'm a real doctor. He's, a, he's got a doctor. Right, right, right. Okay, okay, okay. This is a fact. Bro, okay, I thought you was doing like the thing. Like, you know, no. like the What, the what did you get your doctorate in? Education. Woo! Yeah, yeah, here, South and, Florida. And, and I also did that for the kids. Let me, let me ask you something. Why doesn't so many players, it's, it's, it's like so much of a rumor that when players finish, that they go back broke, like you That's know, true. like 65%. you see the Del- Delonte Del- West, right? And we, and, and, we, and we see we see this, and I'm gonna be honest. When I see the footage, I, I was saying to myself, I hope that's not him. I hope this is a rumor. And then, and then I'm speaking to because you know, obviously, like you said, music and, and, and sports go together. I'm speaking to a lot of my NBA friends, and they're like, that's that's 90 percent of us. It's like almost 70 percent of us. 80 percent. Because it's easy to do. Because they, you spend your money, you get used to the spending habits? No, nah, because the first word you need to understand is FICA, and you don't. So, like, for FICA. FICA. It's on no, the paycheck. No, 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 no. Yeah. It's, it's on the paycheck. So, if you do a $100 million contract, depending on what state you, you can live in, you ain't getting $100 million. Correct. But you spend like you got $100 million. Mm. And that'd be the problem, right? So, so now you got to cut that in half. Let's, let's just go California. So, when I, I live in California, and I can say this, when I lived in California and signed that 120 for set seven, my first year check was 20 million. When I got it, it said 10.9. The, the, the first check that you're supposed to receive was 20 million, but it, it said 10.9. Yeah, FICA, mm. states, all, all the taxes. All, all, all the taxes, taxes. Wrong, right? But I didn't realize that. So I went and bought a house for five million. I'm in a Rolls Royce joint, That's me and my boy right. Alex. Tyson in there, he, he buy two. So I come in there the next day and I'm, I got on Lakers sweats. Me and my boy Alex, we, we looking around. I'm, I'm looking like a bum. I don't like to waste, I like to spend money, but I don't like to waste money. So right. I don't want to spend $400,000 for a car. So I'm like, hey man, how much is this? Nah, how much is this one? Uh. So finally the old guy says, yo man, you asked about all these cars, can you afford them? Mm. Now I'm pissed. I said, what the fuck you just said to me? So I buy three. That one, that one, and I, and I want them dropped off. Move the seat back today, I want them dropped. So I got three Royce Roses that I never dropped. So they go another million, that's six. I'm trying to be a rapper, trying to produce Ooh. my own videos. I, I, you know, I got to pay Eric Sermon and all them right. boys. They go another million, that's seven. Got to fly to San Tropez and get on the boat and all that. So I spent my, I, I spent that 10 million probably in three months, the yeah. whole summer. And then my guy called me and said, you know you spend your whole check. I had money, I had other money, but he said, you know you spend your whole check. Let's just make noise. You're spending 10 million in three months. Yeah. <laughs> 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 That's a quick lesson. It's a learning lesson. It's a learning lesson. So I was like, what do you mean? And like, he said, that bird, man? No. Nah, that's my nigga Sal. Oh, what's up, big Sal? I thought you was Birdman. Sal, he thought you was Birdman. What's Sal, up, big Sal? Much respect. <laughs> no, Sal, but, uh, name, okay. Yeah, so I'm, like, I was, I was still paying, I still had a lot of money, I was paying attention, but 
I was like, okay, now I need to really, and then I was getting married at the time, I was like, now I really need to start paying attention. It ain't about me no more, it's about these babies, so. But yeah, that's true, 65% of what guys. So what was the up. difference for you? What, what changed it for you? you. Did you get? A, did you have the right team around you that helped you invest properly? It's not about the team. It's about you have to have you have to have discipline, and everything has to be structured. All right. So I don't have boys. My boys work for me. We get money together. Mm. Instead of me giving you a hundred thousand, no, we could start a company and we we could do certain things. You could bring it in that way. So put them on salary, like start a company, put them on salary, write that off, get some of that back, rather than just giving them money. And you know, just making the proper investments. I heard Jeff Bezos say, "If you invest in things, going to change people's lives." If you invest in things, that's going to change people's lives. Wow. You will always get the proper return on your money. That's why yeah. I did the Shaq shoe deal. Yeah. That's why I did the ring camera deal. That's ring. why I did the ring, the ring, ring camera. camera. That's why I did Papa John. Like, listen, everybody. <laughs> Everybody, everybody loves pizza. Fucked up, Chad. Look at this nigga. This nigga don't even know how to walk. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he, what do you mean? He's skating over there. <laughs> it's classic. No, no, because you know why? Um, we get to see like people like you, Nas, and Jay Z. You know, live a luxurious life after the sport, after the game, and it's all being like and that's the right investments. From. Being that's where I get it from. You get it from what's that? Watching them. Why? Wow, that's it. Like you, Birdman, right. Dre. Right. Like I saw Jay Z at, at the uh, at the Golden State game, and we just start giggling because he's still doing it. I'm still doing like bro. Right. So he's like, man. Yeah. So I told him, I said, man, much respect. You doing big thing. Right. He's like, nah, much respect for you. Like I watch Puffy. Like it's it's a respect, but it's a competition thing. And when I, I could be I could be jealous without without, without hating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. So I'm like, damn, Puff got his own liquor deal. About to get me a deal. Mm -hmm. Like so, so right. it's, it's it's also competition. It's what drives me. And I heard Snoop say, he said, man, y'all, I'm chasing Diesel. No, I'm chasing Snoop. Mm -hmm. Snoop doing big thing. I'm chasing Jay Z. I'm chasing like when Jay Z started investing and now I started investing with those firms. Who are those take firms? Notes. Yeah, who are those firms? Instead of hating about all that. No, you just learn. So I'm I'm happy that we're all still doing it. So, so and it needs to be a documentary about that. Like the yeah, guys yeah. who started here and like we still doing it. Everybody elevating each other. Yeah. Well. Yeah. So so break it down how it goes for every um every basketball player or every ex baseball player or every ex football player or every ex rapper, every ex DJ that that you know what, you feel like it's time to move on and go into this other life. Because, you know, I was speaking to Buster Rhymes the other day. And Buster was telling me, he's and like, y'all need to give him his respect, too. Oh, Buster, Buster crazy. Buster was one of the best ever. Buster crazy. Oh. And Buster kept saying to me, he's like, man, it's, it, it's time for me to have this other investment that has nothing to do with music. Yeah. And I didn't kind of like realize what he was saying. But what, basically what he's saying is like, I need another life. But how does this happen uh, for you? Like, is this, this happening because you, you spent that 10 million in three months? And then you started to say that I'm gonna invest, or it was just opportunities that presented itself. A little bit of both, but okay. you have, but you, but you have to make it happen. It's right. not gonna happen. You have to make it happen. Right. right. You know, for you know, the good thing about athletes and rappers is we all know how to be spontaneous. Right. Like we can go, we can quick switch thinking. it up. Right. Boom, 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 boom. Like everything I'm doing is like quick thinking. Right. Like I thought I was gonna make that basketball money forever, but then when when I, I realized you're getting older and. At 28, coming down to 22, and at 22, coming down to 14, time to start doing other things. I mean, yeah. and then you, Jay Z did what? Nas did what? Puffy sold his company for it. So like, you start, you know, you get inspiration from other people, and and all you guys give me inspiration. That's like right. you, you persevere. Like yeah. you kind of, I don't want to say disappear, but you right. was chill, you was fat, yeah. man. You know, raising the kids and all right. that, and then right. you popped up doing this thing, and yes, now you're right. back on top. That's right. So. That's right. Let me ask you, what would be your advice, though, to the average person that isn't a ball player, isn't in the music industry? To me, what would be advice to me? So I would say educate yourself. Now, when I say educate yourself, it ain't about going to school, getting a degree. Because I learned about business not from college. I learned about business from a book called The Dummy's Guide to Starting Your Own Business. Mm -hmm. And the first thing I did was incorporate my family. First thing I did is take the cell phones out the personal name and put them in the business name so we can get some of that money back. And then you learned along the way. So just like whatever you want to do, 
educate yourself. And and now, let me tell you something. If I was a 14, 15 now, I'd be a genius. Because you know why? Because information is so available. Yeah. available. Yeah, it's so definitely. available. How to be a DJ. Like the, crazy, like, like, the crazy thing, I had to have one of my homies teach it. Now you can go online and Oh, Google. yeah. Every, and, the yeah, best DJs too, have tutorials. That, that's what I'm right. saying. So, like, so now, like, you, can, you can go to Google and be, how do I want to? So my advice is whatever you want to be, Educate yourself on how you can do right. it, and then just you know go. You literally for it. have uh, virtual mentors, but yes. we had to try to yeah. find a physical mentor. Yes. And what's the name of that book you said? Dummy's, Dummy's Guide to Starting Your Own Business. Wow. And what business you started after we uh, we? Did so that? first thing I did was incorporate Shack. Wow. Yeah. Incorporate Shack and, I, and LLC. I, when you say incorporate. Yeah. And then yeah, LLC, and then I put my mom on salary and put my dad on salary. And you know and we it had helps a, with the taxes, right? To do and you know we had a fan club. You right. know I, I got him my office and got him a car, and they were so proud because the best day of my life was when I got drafted. You know my parents were like congratulations, love you, because you know my dad hardcore. See you later. Right. Don't lose your money. Like he 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 wanted to stay in the army base. I'm like nah, come with me. Man, right. nah, nah, nah. nope. How much you make in the army? Only make sixty dollars. <laughs> now you make a half a million a year. All right. What? You start crying. Okay. Mom, how much you want to make? You make seven fifty a year and put them on like and, 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 and we'll payroll. Yes, and right. and also had to teach him the business. I'm not gonna give it to you. Yeah, just give because they yeah, get spinning and fuck it up. Right. No, but it's yeah. helping him on the tax side. Like you know, my dad, like, half of me, you gonna give me half of me? Like no, I'm gonna break it down into yeah. twelve. Everybody yeah. give you a buck, but yeah. But well, who he taught you that? You got the book, man. Oh, the book. Oh, okay, yeah. okay, okay, the did. book. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, you the did book. Because instead of giving it to the IRS, you're giving it to your family and you can write it off. Why? That's fucking genius. Right. That's fucking genius. So where do you, um, you own, how many clubs you own in Vegas? I own seven restaurants. Jesus. Not clubs? And one club. One club? Yeah. What club is it? It's called Chateau. Chateau. I, I used to own the biggest club in Vegas. It was called Pure. But that was a long, long time ago. And you live in Vegas? Why, why are you invested in Vegas? Because everybody. <laughs> I live everywhere, brother. <laughs> no, I'm telling you, you live in Miami still. No, I do. <laughs> this is I live in Davy. Oh, oh, okay. yeah. Michael Vick. I didn't know that you shot your show here. Oh yeah, this yeah. is the our main spot. No, no, because my boy Alex is like Nori. I was like, man, I love Nori, but I'm not flying to New York. <laughs> yeah. like, it's in Miami. I was like, for real? <laughs> Nori, yeah, yeah, yeah. Miami? Yeah, yeah. Hold on. You just got your license? I just got my license. Make some noise for me, guys. Yeah. Because you would have pulled me over and took me to jail. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, 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 yeah. He's still yeah. not going to drive. Yeah, listen, man, I ain't going to lie to you. Because this is what the thing is. I've always had people to drive for me. That's that's a blessing. That's great. But there's also times where I want to go to 7-Eleven and get some. How do you call this water? Uh, how do you call this again? Acalina El Chichiocho. So I want to get some of that. And I don't want to wait for. Call me for commercial. I don't want to wait for, you know. My wife, somebody to drive me. Right. Sometimes I want to go, and, and I also, I like the new Corvette. And uh, I just want to. Did you get one? No, I'm going to get my man Gogo -Go here. My man Gogo -Go here. Yeah. He, he tried not to let me get one because he wanted me to borrow his. He got two. <laughs> but I want to drive it, and I don't want to drive it with you someone else. You got the red joint? You got the red joint? He got, he, what you got? What, what color you got? Like he has the red one outside right there. Right so, yeah. so I was going to buy the red joint because I. Look, even though I'm a big guy, I like feeling little. So I had a Ferrari one time, convertible. So if you take the convertible top mechanism out, you have like eight to 12 inches, you're gonna move it back. I was gonna do the same thing with the Corvette. Just take the top out, because I don't need the top anyway. Just take it out and just you don't you know, need move the top. it back. I don't need the top. Fuck the top, Jack. Yeah, you know right? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that top, Jack. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, um, yeah, so I figured, I said, you know what? Let me start, because I'm risking my life every time I leave my house to go get a goddamn Swisher Sweet. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> like, because it's going to make a headline news. Somebody going to pull me over and be like, this, that's Nori, nigga. Let's take the jail. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? So I'm saying to myself, I say, damn, bro. So I went through the process, too. Like, you my man JP hooked up. me up. That's crazy. Um, so I, I took the, the, the written road test, and then I get, well, I mean, excuse me, the written test, but then I go got to take the road test. So I want to get it all knocked out. I'm like, I'm not waiting. I'm not waiting till tomorrow. And just my luck, I get like, you know, the guy that knows I'm Nori, don't want to be like nice to me and shit. He's like, so he jumps in. By the way, I was a dickhead for this. I did not realize this. They said, because my name has to be on the insurance for me to take yep. the road test. Right. Yeah. So I pull up and the guy goes in my car. He goes, is this a Mercedes or a Maybach? And I go, 
Oh, the Mercedes make the Maybach. And I said, I failed right there. Yeah. Like, I should have uh, answered the question. Like, yeah, he was wild. so confused. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is this a Mercedes or a Maybach? And I said, I, I said it so right. like nonchalant. You did your driving test on the Benz? I did my driving test in the Maybach. <laughs> But so he goes, so, so the minute he goes, is this a Mercedes or a Maybach? And I sit there and I'm trying to, like I'm talking to like how I would talk to one of my normal friends. I'm like, no, 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 sir. The Mercedes makes the Maybach. And then he, he just. He said, wrong answer. <laughs> I, I said to myself, I failed this shit. There's no way I'm passing it. And then let me just tell you something. If everything could go wrong, it almost went wrong. I got on a big ass Balis Yagas. I don't know if you know. You know how oh, thick the Balenciaga is? Yeah. So I'm hitting lights? gas and brake at the same time because, by the way, I go through the course prior to us doing it before the guy comes again? out. What was you wearing again? The Balenciaga, you know what I'm saying? Come on, come on. <laughs> but I'm talking about the thick ones. I'm not, I'm not trying to floor. But, <laughs> but the Balenciaga's. But, right. um, they're like the, so by the way, me and my man, I can't spell it. Yeah, yeah, uh, uh, <laughs> we go through the course like five, six times. He's he's worried about me backing up. So every, I do everything but back up. Well, I go through the course. So now the guy comes out. He's he's shit faced. He got really? the mask on, and I'm like, I'm like take your mask off, nigga. If you got it, I got it at this point, nigga. Like this, we just go. But I, I don't say that, obviously. I do everything correct. Then he says, give me a three point turn. I said, a th and yeah, I just kept it real. I said, nigga, I, I was in there three hours studying. <laughs> That's it, there ain't no motherfucking three point turn in here. <laughs> <laughs> wow. You ain't no three point turn? All right. What is that? 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 Pump, when you reverse, pump. Go it actually is. Like a U-turn, but three steps. Let's take a trick for that. Let's take a trick for that. The Akalino 88 is hit. So whoever that guy is, by the way, because he wasn't a dick. He wasn't a dick. He wasn't a dick. He was actually a cool guy. He was, But he was being hard on me. But he passed you. He passed me. Yes, go ahead. Baby Shaq, what you doing, Baby Shaq? What you want? No more spitting. No more spitting. It's more on the good side. Shaq. That's been part of since Miami Dade, you know, when he played here. The, Miami Dade? The, the sheriff. The sheriffs. We know. We, Shaq, Shaq is a sheriff. Correct. Yeah. Yeah. Correct. We have the news around. Bad boys. Bad boys. Bad boys. Bad boys. What you gonna do? I've been drinking. I've been drinking. You've been drinking, Sonny? He, he tried to be sentimental with everything. No, 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 I mean, I mean about that. You, you know, you know how I hit. Asking for his head. Asking for his head, sonny. Asking for his head. But what I'm saying is, Shaq, you see every day with the police in America. Oh, you getting serious? We oh, see shit. what's going on. No, I just want to ask somebody. Just who's ask it. Involved. You can say whatever you want. I'm on. I'm with Shaq right now. Okay. How do you? Personally, feel about it because you gotta see some of this stuff that's yeah. going on, and it don't matter. Shaq ain't about that, but you know, when you're part it. of a, when and you, it don't matter if it's in Texas, Las Vegas, North Dakota, I New tell York, whatever. How do you personally feel about that? Because I know you got something personal. When I when yeah. I yeah, they had a little. <laughs> <laughs> when I speak to the police now, I tell them, "Welcome to my life." And they say, what do you mean? I said, when I do something, it affects Reebok, uh. it affects this, it affects that, it affects that. So now when you guys do something, it affects, mm -hmm. right? That's the first thing I tell them. And it hurts me when some guys go overboard. It really does hurt me. But, you know, the ones that do go overboard, they need to be dealt with properly. Because a lot of that stuff they don't teach. I've been to four or five different guys, they don't teach that. And it in, the, in the academy, a, you're saying? Yeah, they don't teach police a lot of job. stuff. And, it, and it's a dangerous job now. But when I was growing up, they had something that was called neighborhood policing. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Like, you know Nori. Mm -hmm. I know the Nori. Made, in the yeah, yeah, from the yeah, neighborhood. Yeah, they're from the neighborhood. Yeah. I know Nori. Right. I know you made a mistake. Right. Let me, before we lock him up, let me go holler at you. Yo, man, I know you're trying to be a rapper. Next mm -hmm. time you, you and the boys go up, like, like we had like that. Like mentoring. We, yeah, yeah so right. we don't have that now. So we need to get back to that. So. You know, I'm the director 
of community relations in, in Atlanta, Georgia. I'm trying to bring the police and the community back together. Again, I don't stand for it when people break the law. So if as an officer, if you do something crazy, you need to be dealt with properly. But I tell them all the time, when one does something, it affects us all. When one rapper does something, when one podcaster does something, it's gonna affect us all. And you know, they, they need to know and understand that. So what about the, the police, policing as a gang? Like where the good ones might be good, but they're not gonna tell on the bad ones. Well, that's something that has to be dealt with too, because you know that's a culture in itself. Well, it's a culture for everybody, right? Right? It's a culture for that rappers. Affects all of us, right, right? Yeah, it's a culture for rappers. You know, it's a culture for us. Like if if I knock somebody out in here right now, not not one of us, but let's just say somebody came off the street and I knock somebody out, y'all ain't gonna rap me out. Nothing. That's what I'm saying. So it is it that 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 that's a different conversation. So those, a you don't think that policing should be at a different held at a different standard than us right here? No, they should. Right. That's what I'm saying. They should. But listen, you, you know how it is. Right. You know how it is. And again, that's a different conversation. I don't want to get into that conversation no. because <laughs> the way right. I think may not be the way other people think. That's right, why right. I don't come out and talk a lot. But sure. I can say that if you break the law and if you don't listen to what's what's written down and how they teach you, something got to happen to you. Absolutely right. Nah, that's real shit. That's real shit. So we, we, we basically damn near covered almost everything, but I, I got a little bit more. Good. I got to pee again. You got to pee again? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah. There's a little bit more. I'm Before somebody that. might spit yeah, out. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> okay, go pee again. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Go, go, go on your side, Shaq. I know you are, bro. Go pee again, because I got my other, my other um, sons coming here. They want a picture with you. They'll be in yeah, 10 minutes. Yeah, I got minutes. you. Yeah, guys, you want to pee again? Yeah. All right, I'll wait. Okay, all right, cool, cool, cool. All right, cool. Um, yeah, yeah. I didn't know you was Cuban. Yeah. yeah. I went yeah. to Cuba. What you thought? I went to Cuba that. too. What you, no, you thought? What you thought he was? Keep it real. Okay, I don't want to disrespect nobody, but one time I called a Cuban girl a Puerto Rican. She tried to oh, fight yeah, me. Oh yeah, in the beginning. Oh, yeah. she oh tried no, she fight. tried to now, fight look, me. I was Puerto Rican. She tried to fuck you. You said fight me. Fight, uh -oh. fight me. <laughs> yeah, no, fight me. Yeah. Now, look. And, and uh, one time I called a Dominican girl Puerto Rican. That's what happened. Yeah, that goes. Yeah, I was called fight. Mexican and Puerto Rican after 9/11. I was oh, called. Uh, you need to come over here for the next test in TSA. Like, you, you, you from over there? Yeah, that's real. She you went off. Sam uh, there, right? no? Oh yeah, Sam. Hey, you play against Haitian, Haitian, right? Polynesian. They're Haitian, right? Yeah, they're Haitian. Haitian. So that's why he's Haitian. I told him so. But he didn't want to Haiti yet. We went to Haiti. He didn't want to come with us. I told these guys, fifty percent of the is us, but they don't believe me though. No, we believe it. Why? Well, but you're not Haitian, though. No. Oh, the no. way you said it, though. The way you said it, I ain't been to Haiti either. Shaq is borderline a Haitian man. <laughs> say that again. Shaq no, no, say that again. It's borderline a Haitian. No, nah, that's real though. No, no, but say it again. Say Shaq is borderline Haitian. Shaq. No, no, say Shaq is borderline a Haitian. Shaq is a Haitian. <laughs> 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 yeah, really, really, what is that name? Is that an African Bro, name? Bro, this is a first. Oh, it's a Muslim. It's Muslim. This is the first, oh, uh, 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 first show where you're going to have about a million viral clips from this show. <laughs> yeah, but hold on, hold on. Yeah. How come, if this is a Muslim name, how come it's not, not one other Muslim I know in the world named Shaquille? No, that actually oh, no. makes sense. It's a lot. Yeah, it's other people He's named original. Shaquille. Yeah, yeah. So, so when when I became on the scene, there was like thousands of people named Shaquille. Mm -hmm. So oh, wow. when I was when I was born, my mother comes from a very religious family and born out of wedlock, so they kind of ousted her. Yes, so sir. she walking down the street in Newark and she meet a brother who has a, Muslim, a book full of Muslim names, and Shaquille Rashan means little warrior. Mm, wow. So she's wow. like, okay, y'all kicking us out? It's just gonna be me and my little warrior. So I've always loved the name because it was God-given. What I mean by that, growing up, I always wanted a, I always wanted a nice basketball name. Larry Bird. Buster Rhymes calling me right now. Should I tell him that we live on Drink Yeah, chance? you can call him. Like Larry Bird, Magic Buster Johnson, Rise, I'm Michael sorry, George, I put you live Shaquille on Drink Chats with Shaquille O'Neal. Shaquille O'Neal's right here. Okay, I'll call you back when I finish. All right, my, my brother. So I always wanted that. Sounds that, like a serious call. So <laughs> always wanted that uh, that uh, dope name, Shaquille O'Neal. So it is a dope name. I think it was, you know, God given. Yeah, great. Right. How do you feel about the youngest person to like the older person connecting with you, relating to you? I told my mom, Shaq's gonna be on this. He knew who he was. He's 80. So they, they have a word role model. For me, I had to change it to real model. Mm. Not going real model. Real model. I, I can't play wow. a role, get that bag. Right. I have to be who I am, and if you accept me, 
And I know, it. and I know most people will accept me because my worst fear is my mother looking at TV and see me acting crazy. That's right. Not acting funny, acting crazy. So because or I not have, acting like yourself. Yes. So that's be, it, that's because it. I have the respect for her, I'm always right. be nice. I'm always be courteous. And I'm 50. I don't want no problems. Mm -hmm. Like right. I, we we don't been battle tested to do all that. When I see people now, what up, homie? It mm -hmm. ain't yeah. it ain't yeah. no more. Yeah. Yep. It ain't no more who. Nah, I'm, I'm 50. Yeah, we, we, we mugging and shit, right? We, we done I been there, done same. that. I don't want no problems with nobody. Same. What's up? How you doing? I don't care what you do, what you represent, who you with. Yeah. Peace, love, and respect, and we move on. Because I'm pro. We didn't, I, I did all that. Yeah. I done did all the mean mugging and beefs and trying to fight everybody. We passed that. We passed the test. We here now. We know we professional. Oh, we know we doing all this. To yeah, we got kids. So I, 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 I just try to make people happy. You know, just make people smile. Nah, and man, you do that. You, you, and you, you do, do that. that. And you Thank do you. that. Man. Yeah, man. Nah, nah, I, 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 I can't front, man. Like, um, me just watching you, um, me watching your career from the beginning, uh, you know, and, and I can't say to the end because there's no ending to it. And me just seeing you prosper and, and having so many uh, different businesses, it, it inspires me. Nah, I'm stuck on. <laughs> no, 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 it inspires me. <laughs> Take another shot for that. You know what? I'm gonna no. tell you. I'm gonna tell no, you. You know why? Because yeah. you can't break my thumb. Can you get <laughs> Is, you know, when we, we grow up in the hood, they say, they say, they say this, if you want to be a millionaire, you got to have seven jobs, right? Yeah. So I be feeling like if, if that's the truth, then you should show me those seven jobs. Mm -hmm. A lot of people don't, they, a, lot, a lot of people will show you that one or two jobs and then they won't let you know about the ring. Right. They won't let you know about the, the fire truck that they, you know what I mean? They, don't they hire you on the side. Or, or, or let me remix that for you. Mm -hmm. Why they got to show you? Why don't you go out and create seven of your own jobs? Yeah. That's real. Man. That's, yeah, I, I, that's what yeah, it is. Yeah. yeah, like you don't like like you don't need no because because every, everybody's not gonna give up the secrets. I, I always give up the secrets. Right. First thing I tell kids, listen to your mommy and daddy. Mm. Huh? I said because like they, oh how did you get so? First thing I listen to my mommy and daddy. So I made a lot yeah, of money yeah. listening to Shaq, a drill sergeant and a secretary. And I'm gonna get to that. Okay. Mm. Listen to somebody you believe in and you trust. Those. Boys and girls club mentor, police officers, or somebody that you look up to. Listen, because if you don't listen, you ain't going to make it anyway. Right, right, right. right if right. you don't listen, you're not going to make it. And if you don't listen, you're not going to have that one Facts. person, that beacon. So, yeah. so do right. you learn to be an entrepreneur? Because you've mentioned many times about being an entrepreneur so, or like a joint ventureship. Like you've done, you said that. So, to touch on. so when I'm reading the book, I don't understand anything. I don't that means understand that. to open the business. Yeah, I don't understand it. But I understood joint ventureship. It is a partnership. So then I said, okay, let me try it out. I want to start a sneaker company. I'm not going to China. I'm not setting up no factory. Like this costs, I ain't, I, I ain't got that money yet. Mm. I can't pay a hundred people in China who I can't see. You need someone with that infrastructure. Yeah, that infrastructure. That's where the joint venture come at. So let me do, let me get on the call. Hey, who makes his shoes? Oh, he make, let me get his name. But a gentleman by the name of Steve Jackson, LA. He was doing Converse and a lot of shoes. So we had a conversation. He's here. He already has that infrastructure. So my joint venture is with him. Of course, he gets his piece. I get my piece. So right. I have my own shoe company, but yeah. I don't really have my own shoe company where I own 100% solely right. by myself. So I had to do a joint venture. So most of my deals are joint venture. I want to do a water company. I don't want to buy no factory. I don't want to have to deal with the FDA. Oh, yes. they, they already got it. So I want to do a podcast. The my, big podcast. My, my man, he's a DJ. <laughs> yeah. My man, he's famous. My man right here, he look like me. <laughs> I don't know who this dude is like that. <laughs> you know, so like, you just... My whole life. I've been talking about it. You know, so you just do... So that's how I you know, tend to do my business. And then when you base it on, on respect and trust, it, it can never go wrong. Like if I'm going to do, do this liquor thing, yeah. I'm not going to start from the bottom. I'm going to do a JV with somebody that's already has shelf space, distribution. Listen, right, right now, yeah. right now, I was going to do a liquor company. And a friend of mine, he's he's in here, and he said, I cannot let you start from the bottom. You got to start from the top. <laughs> you do. That's and, how you um, do it. They mad at me right now. <laughs> the, other, the other company, I, so I had to walk away. He said, let's walk away. But he's, he's right, though, like because sometimes we work so hard and then we, we want to have ownership, but what, what, what we do is we start from the bottom of the ownership. And 100% then, ownership, 50%, 10% still yep, ownership. Right. Still ownership. And then, you know, so... 
It's 100% of nothing or 50% of a lot. Yeah, uh, that, that, that's, sometimes why. you can have 100% of something that's not worth nothing. Right. And then when you get that, you move on to something else. See, people yeah. ask me why I'm, I work hard. Not that I work hard, it's just that I'm, I'm programmed not to be complacent. Right. right. After this, I got to go do another podcast. Mm-hmm. You should tell us that. Yeah, that's no, disrespectful. No, it's right? not. No, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> nah, we fuck that shit. We ain't hate. We ain't hate. Okay, we can't. That's real. What the fuck are you doing, Chad? Listen, <laughs> my own. Oh, okay, okay. 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 Oh, my God. Oh, shit, you ain't gonna fight us? I, I would love to, but I don't like to bother you, brother. Uh, no, no, you can bother me, oh, brother. Yeah, I, 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 yeah I, you can bother me. Oh, I do, yeah. You know, yeah. I, I don't I'm like to bother me. Where do you film your podcast at? At my house. Oh, okay. Nah, I don't have all this luxurious. I just have a laptop and a little camera. You signed yourself? Sign what? You sign to yourself? We can do a joint yeah. venture. Let's do a joint venture. <laughs> no, we can. Yeah, yeah, yeah for real. Hip hop so, and sports. Yeah, okay, hip hop and sports. Is that what my man? What's my man name? Um, the comedian dude. Um, he does dances. Spice like that. Adams. Yes, that, 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 that's, that's my partner. Yeah, that's my partner. Yeah, that's, that's my, that's my, my guy. The big like, I don't think I met him in real life, yeah, but no, I, I follow him so Larry. much on Instagram yeah, that Larry. I think I know him. Like, like that's how much I follow him. That's his code. I might walk up to him and be like, "What's up, my nigga?" He might be like, "What the fuck is wrong with him?" Because I just feel like I know him. Um, and, and him and Afri on Crockett. Oh, the funniest dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's another thing, Jack. So many people does impressions of you. Who was your favorite person that does impressions of you? Mm. Jay Fowler, Afri on Crockett. Aries. Kevin Hart got a good. Aries Spears. So Aries Spears, Spears, Spears does it uh, great. Uh, so you say uh, Aries Spears is your favorite? Uh, Jerry Fox. Jamie Foxx does yeah, it good. They are. But you know, I like that. You like it? You know why? Because I like laughing. You like laughing, and then I'm not. I'm not to the point to where I'm all that to where I can't laugh at a joke. It's funny, like, but imagine me trying to fight Avion Crockett because he did an impression. That's silly. Yeah, I don't, I don't do silly stuff. <laughs> Back in the day, I was real silly, but you, you, you know what I realized it was silly? Because we all chase useless titles. Mm-hmm. You're the best DJ ever. What does that mean? Oh. Are, are you are you getting paid? Or right. Are you getting paid a check from some secret organization that says you're the best? Right. You're the best big man ever. You're the man. Like, but what does that mean? Don't mean nothing. Right. Don't mean nothing. So like, once I learn to stop doing that and just have more fun, everything everything blossoms. That's yep. dope. Like that's you dope. got the best podcast, and y'all do have the best podcast. As it we really is. But we don't appreciate yeah, it. That's a, that's we, a, yeah, yeah, that's a. Yeah, that's a. I think we have a good one. Yeah, yeah you do. A that's a good one. And I ain't gonna lie, you but drink a lot of beers today. In y'all category, it's only two of y'all. So there's right. a lot of people that do it, but it's only two of y'all. Yeah, we, and you know who the other ones is, we right? We love everyone. Who's no, the other one? Who's the other one? Gilly and Walla. Yeah, I mean, that's absolutely. Yeah, so, so nah, in that category, we love it. In this guess, category, hey. it's only y'all two. Yeah, y'all yeah. like, hey. y'all like. Guess, I, but guess what, Shaq? Let me tell you how how real I am. We love me and I was worth a game. We love Joe Button out there. We love Rap, Rap Radar. They coming back oh. out. We love, uh, yeah, exactly who? Um, but, um, Angela, 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 I, every time they always say your this. Your son a model? Who? Your son. He, he could be. That motherfucker beautiful. Oh, okay, I got that. I'm not saying. But, but, um, but Shaq called you beautiful, so yeah, different. Yeah, no, no, yeah. but, <laughs> but everyone, like Harold Miner came to the league. They got that like, pretty ass hair. They're like, they're like, <laughs> Harold Miner, when Harold Miner came to the league, they're like, that's the new Jordan. Yeah, All these people. And then Zion. Zion. What do you feel about Zion? Because cause Zion. I like him. Yes. I think they're giving them too much slack. Slack? In Not a, slack. In a negative way. Yes, in a negative way. Right. Like they're talking about his weight. Yeah. Leave the man alone. Like I, you put a guy in front of me with the six pack and all that, I'm going to kill his ass every time. Right. I'm going to eat that Popeye's, I'm going to go eat the Papa John's, I'm going to drink a water, I'm going to drink a Pepsi, and I'm going to destroy his ass. <laughs> I, I love it. That. Every time. <laughs> so. Listen, the man can play. He got bounced, but you got all these experts. He needed to nah. He just needed to play, have fun, and take care of fans. I like his game. I'm I'm, I'm anxious to see what he can do. He putting up numbers. His second year, he just got hurt, and you know, oh, his weight, weight. Leave that man alone. Like everybody, not gonna have. I never had. I'm starting to get a six pack now, but I never had that. I don't need that. It's all up here. And why they gotta put him playing video games overweight? That's that visual was bad. That was. I mean, but was that him really or? 
I mean, yeah, it was with Morant. I think. It's so I, I won't say overweight. He's just big boned. I'm not gonna say because I'm. Yeah, I'm, he's I'm young. Not he's young, young. But he oh, listen. Awesome. He got bounced though. And yeah. then and then you know for guys like us, like like when I came to Miami, they shackled. So I lost. I was weak, bro. Mm -hmm. When you lost weight, yeah, man, right? I was like, because mm -hmm. remember, I'm Shaq, so people coming to me like this, I was, I was always bruised and hurt up, but when I had that meat, yeah. I was unstoppable. So, so you I look like him when I had all that meat. <laughs> <laughs> you were the chupacabra. <laughs> You, you said Allen Iverson intentionally tried to go at you, right? No, you yeah. I, like, I couldn't block it like he. So. But, you, but you tell me there's other people in the NBA who wanted to, like, dunk on Shaq. Like, that was, that was a post up. Like, yeah. like, Vince Carter tried to get me one time. I had to lay him out. Ooh. Do I remember that? I forgot. Baseline in Miami. In Miami. And then the next play down, he, 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 he uh, got Zoe. Yes. yes. Yeah, okay, I, I remember that. Yeah. Oh, I, do I mean, but, I mean, but before that, yeah, I had to lay him out. Holy shit. Okay. So, so Shaq. Irv Gotti, what's up, big dog? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my <laughs> boy. Oh, my 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 Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Angel, yeah. My bad, dog. Yeah, I thought just. <laughs> <laughs> Angel, Angel, I'm not going to lie. I'm taking a shot for that, man. We're going to take a piss for this shot. Can I get an okay back here? Pass that up. Look at that, though. Man, can I get one, too? You sure? Yeah, man. So, Shaq, you said Shaq. I know, I think you good. I'm going to keep it real. I'm going to like. You got to be good. You gotta be good. I look just like. Uh, you know I'm gonna mean? keep it real and I'm gonna be fair with you. Because I asked Jay Z the same yes. shit. We taking the shot for Can this? You're the only two people that I know that got an Audemars deal. Uh, oh, wow. Salute. Salute. Okay, deal? Salute. Audemars. So I wore my Audemars today because uh, oh, I'm pleading shit. my case with you. You want an Audemars? I want Jack Audemars. Oh, no, those are hard to get. Those are done, right? Can only made. That far? How many we make? Yeah, we only made 32. Ooh, okay. 32? Yeah. Oh, Great man. number. So the so Which is great. Yeah, it's your oh, number. Oh, That's Shaq's oh, actual real oh, number. Yeah, I hit Jay. I was like, yo, I want to I wanna change. So I got to be good for that. Baltimore. He was like, well, good luck, Playboy. That's how I feel. 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 So did those, so that's really for real. When they make thirty two, this is it. Let me, you don't have one in the crib in Orlando with the fifty bed. You don't have one. The fifty no. person bed. Dude, the 50, <laughs> he's there with the fifty bed. Under, under the fifty person. With bed. the fifty person bed. No, you ain't got one. Cause you don't. You don't really fuck with watches. You know what? No, I do. I have uh, uh, Invicta watches now. Invicta. That's yeah. you. You invested into it. And I can get you those whenever you want. The big job. Uh, yeah, I'm not yeah, sure about Invicta. I'm just keeping it on. No, no. Why, why not? <laughs> No, no, why, why not? I'll take it. No, 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 no,
He gonna break you out four diamond joints. Come on, let me show you. Go. Yeah. Yes, I, 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 I need you. I got you. Oh. I got you. Yeah. I'm, I'm invicted out. No, no way. I, I need got you. See them? That's it. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna take five. I'm not gonna wear it. Six. Ten. I'm gonna take that. Six. Ten. Twenty. Thirty. Yeah, we, yeah, we can't leave without um. No, we can't leave without taking a piss. You gonna take a piss? No, no, I'm gonna right, hold on. Let's see. I'm gonna hold that people. The accolades that were mentioned earlier is all, all astronomical, all dope. The the Oscar award that you won, making that short film for Louisa Harris, just to Ooh. change the topic. Mm. How did you know she was somebody to to make a documentary about? And how well, did you do dope. it? Good question. That's you know, one, question. one thing I could never do is steal somebody's shine. Documentaries are already done. Right. I just help magnify it. It's it already done. Oh, already, already done. done. Yeah, magnify it. No, I had somebody put at the end say, do this and do this. But I like to be an aficionado. Right. Like when you talk about hip hop, I know his stories. That's the beginning. You right. talk about wow. DJ, I know your story. I was right. there. I never heard of this one before. And I was like, oh, how can I? How could I have not heard about a woman that was good enough to play in the NBA? Mm. So when I heard her story, so I'm like, yeah, NBA. So I'm like, if I didn't wait, hear wait. NBA. NBA. Yes, she got drafted by the Utah Jazz. She was the what, first that's woman. That's Joanna, man? Yes. Yeah, Crazy. No, no. Come Harris. on, bro. Oh, yeah. Come on, man. No, she was. Come on, man. Come on. 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 Did she play? I got an Oscar. Me, you know, me and him, me and him didn't compete on everything. Right. Friendly thing. Who? That's what we do. Kobe won an Oscar. Me, okay. and, me and all my friends compete. Right. I, I lost a thousand dollars to Alex today because he said he told y'all to have the water in. I said they're not gonna do it because I never seen a water good. Yeah, I gave it no, to no. him. You should ask so, so we always <laughs> compete. Dollars. So the fact that he got one, yeah, I like to have one too. Like I'm, again, I could be jealous. And be inspired by my jealousy. And without hate. Not hate. I ain't without gotta hate. hate. Right. Like, damn, he got an Oscar, I'm gonna give me an Oscar. Damn, he got a pie. Not, man, Nori. Uh, Nori ain't well, been high. Yeah, that. yeah, like yeah. yeah, so, like, so, like, when I get jealous, I get inspired. So, no, but I yes. mean, not, not to take nothing away from Kobe. Right. You coming from Newark, you're in New Jersey. I gotta say. He's from Jersey. I'm from He's New from Jersey. Passaic. I'm know, from Passaic. Like all right, so, already. So, so, <laughs> so take Listen, Queens all day, bro. So I gotta say, we get it, y'all. Next, next, we get it. The next city, next time. Okay, we're the first state. We're the first state. Y'all guys are the eleventh state. But when they told you, when they told you, you won an Oscar. That's not basketball. That's not entrepreneur. That's. I like this person. That's what? Is that for blue chips? No, that's for no for the documentary. Are you wild and blue chip? I'm programmed not to get excited. Because there's more to do. Because no, you're dead. Uh, yeah, because like, like, like my father wouldn't let me get excited. Like you can get excited in a moment, but every time you won a championship, I fear the call. Hello, yes sir. Bring your ass home. Bring my trophy. Mm. Yeah. So now I gotta rent the plane and bring my trophy. And my dad's <laughs> sitting there. And he's like, I go get another one. Have fun this summer. Go get another one, motherfucker. So See, that's like, how my yeah, dad no, was. No, that's yeah, the so, now. So, but, like, but did you I, I feel gotta, love in that though? Did you I, feel love in, in through that? Accomplishment. Yeah, but, but not love. Did you? Yeah. But you, it's it, the toughest you still love felt ever. love though. Like he wasn't so, doing that to be fouled. I finally asked him towards the end of my career. I said, "Why'd you do that?" He said, "Cause I never want you to be complacent." Mm, this is important. Like, Cause like I, I used to, he used to put it on the thing, and then when I come back next time, it don't be there. What the trophy? Yeah, Larry O'Brien. Yeah, wow. like from, like but everywhere, all the college, everything. Like he'll, he'll let you see it, and then when I come back next time, I was like, "Really? Get a trophy?" Because you need to replace it. Give me another one. Wow. Yeah. So hard. Yeah, give me another. So like, oh, the, so the year I was winning, I went very, very hard. And then the third one, which we won in Jersey, he like cried, break down. He's like, "Man, you done everything I asked. We good." Mm. Like he's like, he's like, 
You don't need to win nothing else. You, yes. you better make it good. I'm leaving everybody alone. You better make it good. We we gonna we gonna Shaq. <laughs> do you guys get your own little Larry O'Brien show? Individual. <laughs> Man, like you got one in your crib. <laughs> I like it. No, we, no, we do. do no, we do. Because you got four. <laughs> yeah, no, you got your own. I thought you were going to have a little guy. So, or you just got the championship rings. Nah, the I'm just so, and they get the rings. So, so with the rings, everything, I passed my father. So yeah. when he passed away. You what? I gave everything to my father. The rings. So everything. you got the rings Yes. Too. So when he passed away. I received the bag and I got sections in my house to where it's you know it's uh, dedicated to him. But right. and so, he outlived your mother? No. Yes. Did. No. What? What'd you ask me? He outlived your mother? No. My father passed away. So what, I'm saying, but you wouldn't give anything to your mother? No, she don't care about that. Okay. Okay. Yeah, okay. She don't. She's just. She wants to act right. Yeah. She's just. You know. Like I'm. I'm. I'm, I'm just taking, baby. Right, yeah, right, right. So I was. Uh, so I have them now, and I always made homeboy replicas of the ring because they used to make the ring. But you know, I'm from, you know, I had to ice mine out. So, <laughs> so like the original rings were just, you know, sitting in the house. <clears throat> That's dope. No, but now they're making the rings. Nice. I now know. it's like I, Jacob I, making them. Yeah, shit. You need a big three. 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 Ice Cube went to 42nd Street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He got his shit. What do you think about the big three? I like it. You like it? Look, I like it. Would you fuck around? No, I wouldn't do it. Because uh, I, I, I right. think coach is big. No, that. because I Shaq because one of those. Guys. Because when you say the name, about on a team. Nah, I don't do it. Because because when you say you own the Sacramento Kings for yeah, a piece of it. A piece, you still do? No, okay. I sold it. So like when you say the name Shaq, y'all remember the Shaq with his legs up, Duncan. Ooh. I'm not that guy no more. So That's if I go good. out there now, I don't want y'all to see me like that now. Mm. So yeah. and and plus I did enough in like if I didn't do much in the league. Then I'll probably go out there and just say, no, I, I could have been and I'd do it, but. That's a good way to look at yeah, it. Though. So, yeah. like, so you, you, know. you, you, don't, you don't think. No, you don't I'm, think I'm right 50. now. No. You don't think if, if Lil Shaq right now, y'all play one on one. Oh, Listen. I'm going to kill him. <laughs> that's Shaq. all I want to hear. Yeah, that's all I want to hear. I was almost in the league. No. In Haiti, in Haiti. In Haiti, in Haiti. In Haiti, in Haiti. That's what you're saying. Yeah, I'm drinking a shot. I'm drinking a shot. It's a Zombie. So Steve Style calls me. Steve Style says, I got somebody that want to do a record with you, right? This is right after you. Yeah. We did do that record. I, I did do. I did yeah, a record shit. with you, and then after this, I did you a record with. Uh, no, I don't. I, I could find it though. I did a record, and then I walk in the studio, and it's Kobe Bryant there. So I'm like, Kobe, I gotta write this guy's rhyme real quick. So, <laughs> so I write the rhyme for me, and then I write the rhyme for Kobe. I, I knock it out real fast. Boom, boom, boom. True story. Kobe walks in the room, and he goes, "Why do you have two verses?" Like, you know, nigga, one is yours. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have two. I only have one. <laughs> He's like, engineer, erase the other one. Uh. And I'm looking at Kobe because I'm like, there's no way. And by the way, he's, he's speaking in French Real to the music. engineer. Yeah. Oh, because the good. engineer, well, for some reason, I'm understanding it. I don't understand French at all. <laughs> for some reason, you for understand For some reason, I just was <laughs> just like, like, yo, what, what, you just, what are you talking about? He's like, no, 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 Nori. <laughs> oh, I write my own shit. <laughs> and I was so, like, disappointed and impressed at the same time. <laughs> I was disappointed. I was like, damn, my check just cut in half real fast. <laughs> but then I was impressed because Kobe, Although I know he's not a real, real MC, he would not. He wanted to be Kobe even as a MC. Right, in the studio and I was, as well. I was impressed. So I tell you the funny thing. <laughs> and that was nice. No, no, no. Oh, 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 yeah, he fucked up. Oh, yeah. So, I, so let me tell you the funny thing. So I was impressed. So we did the record. We completed the record. Then later on that night, Trackmaster says, let's go to Mr. Child's, let's go to dinner. I get so drunk that I come up to Kobe Bryant. I'm like, I just want to keep it real. I think I could beat you one on one right now. <laughs> and Kobe
hope he's thinking about it. This is how you know he was like a real champion. Because he was he almost said, okay, let's go. Because <laughs> yeah, no, I look at Steve Stout, everybody's looking around because I said it with bass in my voice, but everyone knows I'm playing. Everyone knows I can't. I know I can't beat Kobe Bryant. But the Hennessy told me I think I could win tonight. <laughs> so Kobe's like, where's the closest court? Uh oh. And the closest court is actually Queensbridge. Because remember, if everyone remember 57th, the first original Mr. Childs is on 57th Street. If you actually take a left and you make a right, you're in Queensbridge. So I said, Kobe, let's, let's go to QB. And I was going to challenge Kobe one on one. By the way, I think he would have killed me. He would have whooped you. Man. And I think he would have not. Been merciful on me. Not at all. Classic. But because this is how I, this is how I know he was like this. Yes. This is how I know he was a real champion. Was he actually thought about <laughs> it? Like he actually looked at me and was like, "But well, where's the closest court?" And I was like, "Hey, we got another superstar in the house." Oh, that's right. He's back. Holy shit! Oh, oh. Holy shit! Hey, not oh, a You man. Oh, you. Oh, Yes. Everyone say hello to Sugar Shane Mosley. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Are you want to take a picture? Box for real? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, E-box. Yeah, E-box. Yeah, E-box. Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Good luck, baby. 19th in the nation. Oh, no. Good luck, baby. Oh, my God. Oh, you lose. Yeah, yes, yes. You lose. It's, it's, uh, are, 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 are you a boxing fan? Of course. Who? who, who I see you say Sugar Shane Mosley. Tank. Killing the game. To my um Javante. Javante. I think Floyd, like, and then you know, same but the same conversation we had about basketball and um uh, MCing could do the same thing about boxing. Who's the greatest boxer ever? I A think generation. I think it's Floyd. I think it's Floyd. Lost. I, I, I think, think it's Floyd, Floyd. But you know, some people say Tyson, Ali, and all that stuff. By the way, I party with Floyd and then I see him run five miles home. Mm, I see I party with him. Seen no, him he's... drinking cranberry juice, thought it was vodka. I'm saluting the nigga the whole time. Oh shit, nigga, let's do it. Oh shit, let's, let's yeah, no, go. No, no. And that nigga jogged home. I said, wait a minute, that nigga wasn't drinking vodka the whole time. Yeah, no, no. Yeah. So I think he's the best boxer. I, like, I think he's the best. Like boxing, like bare knuckle boxing, uh, like UFC. I like it all. I like sports. Bare knuckle boxing. Who's my man from out here? Um, Kimbo Slice. Kimbo Slice. That's that's nice. Nice. Yeah, Kimbo Slice. R.P. That was the best. Yeah. I, I kid you not. That was. That was the first time. I don't like seeing fights on the internet that's not. I do. You do? <laughs> I don't like seeing none of that. Well, no, nah, it's entertaining. I, I can't stand it. I, I, what you, you better, you better, you I better not embarrass us. Shit. I love it how my friend. Yeah, we don't believe in him. <laughs> God did. God did. What's that cartoon character that, that was drunk all the time? <laughs> not Back the drunken monkey. No, uh. That was drunk all the time? He was a cat. I think he was a cat. That's who he's sound like he right cat? now. He yeah, he's clear. Right. Okay. That's who he's he sound like right drunk. now. Okay. But, Shaq, who was the um, the player, the player that you would say that could party the most? Whether you played with them or not. GP. GP. Gary Payton. Gary Payton. Gary Payton. That's why he got renamed it to him He's right man. now. Because he can party sure. every yeah, night, yeah. but still show so up like to the game yes. and play big yeah. ball. Like, it, it, the glove. I love that. It, I love if that. If he didn't party, he wasn't going to play well. He got his own share with Kobe. Oh, I said that. You got to pay What did you say? What happened? What you said? No, what is that? No, because he said, he's, I was talking about the glove. He said he got his own strand of weed. I said that's the reason why. <laughs> because. Oh, okay, got it. So he would go out and party. If he didn't party, he didn't play well. Oh, Me either. He was also uh, on the 2016. Uh, yeah, so when we were here, we had to move practice back. Because Pat liked to go at 8, 9, 10. We had to move back to 12. Because you see Club Live going yeah, crazy. Yeah, all of us. Man, we all were. Yeah, we all were. But I, I don't drink. But they would they would actually party hard. But go to work in the game. Mm. Go to work in the game. So, yeah, GP. Wow, GP, Gary Payton. We need him. We need him. And shout out to his son for winning the chip this year, too. Oh, really? Gary Payne Jr. with the Warriors. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. He's oh, right shit. He's What's that? Oh, you got about 10 lines. Uh, it, don't take oh, you, it don't take you three minutes to piss. <laughs> 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 he 
took a boo boo. <laughs> what? And I'm taking you to the medicine pest. You took a boo boo. You took a boo boo. I have one more. I gotta get back to. Your acting side, you yeah. moved on to now, you're gonna move on to making films. And, and I did my homework, man, so Jersey Legends Productions, please talk about it. Oh, Jersey Legends Productions, like, for, for, so. I've That's always, their company. Yeah, I've always had the ability to control the commercials and make up the commercials. All the commercials you see are made up by me. Mm. And I actually went to film school to see how all this works, and I was gonna do it a long time ago, but now is the time to start my own production company, start producing, start directing, and doing all that stuff. So uh, we're gonna be we're gonna be taking all documentaries, and we're gonna be taking all, That's what it's all based concepts, on mainly documentaries, yeah, the documentaries, movies, whatever. You know, we're gonna give opportunities, you know, to give people people jobs. Uh, just started a. Uh, African American, well, 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 multicultural agency, and you know we won a lot. Of, we we won our first awards because when you, if you look in the if you look in the business of you know agencies where to go out, it's not a lot of us. So I just started one where it's, it's mostly all of us, and you know we're doing doing big things. But Jersey Legend Productions, I, I want to do stuff like this. I want to you know be behind the scenes instead of mm. instead of being behind the camera all the time. Mm. No, that's that's that, that, that's real. So 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 yeah. Oh, oh man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No no hold on hold on hold on. No guys, honey, guys. No, 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 you stunt double? Fourth stunt double. I'm still fourth. They're sitting down. He's sitting down. I'll tell you what. Shaq, come on. I'll tell you what. I'll grow beard and all that shit. If I do it, I'll do it. You can do prosthetics. Prosthetics. Just for men. I'll do my thing. Let him talk, bro. I'll give you my word. If I do a commercial in Miami, you got the job. Woo! Yes. You should do the Creole overdubs. Yeah, it's for the Zos. Yeah. I just have to say that. So I just want you to know, um, you know, um, we have this whole thing that's going on that um like, like he is the Sunny D. He's our friend, but he's not ace approved. <laughs> <laughs> he can drink go, everything man. else on this table. <laughs> what? But the people at Ace of Spade do not, they're not fond of him drinking the Ace. <laughs> 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 He's not Ace of Spade. <laughs> put a glass on now, man. Hey, Jack. Oh, put this on, put this on. Yeah, put this on. Put this on. If you're gonna play him, you better beat him right now. Wait, 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 wait. Don't, 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 don't. Let's see. Give us your base. Your base. Do y'all vote that he gets on the ace list? <laughs> All of us said no. Shaq says yeah. We were not on his friend. So we would yeah. like to ask you. Yes, put Shaq. him on the list. Yeah, I would have wanted to let know. Yeah, put him on the list. Now we're going to edit this part out. No, 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 no. Don't say we. I, I would have voted yes. I would have voted yes. I would have voted you yes. Everybody votes yes. You just, you embarrass us sometimes. What did you say about We're your parents and you respect them, you love them, but you know, I just got to be but real with you. But Sonny's happy and he's We're a great guy, man. We're all 20 year brothers. We listen, got great listen, energy. We listen, love I'm just tell you something. We have Patty LaBelle here. He's the only one that can lay just to Patty LaBelle. <laughs> you said shake what your mama gave you. Hold on. We all, it wasn't a good Shaq, moment. We cut him off. We cut him off. You got to show the video. No, no, no. Shaq, what is it the same thing? 
No, he wouldn't. No, he wouldn't. No, he wouldn't. Who got the video? Who got the video? Let's go. We gotta show it to him. We gotta show it to him. Show it to him. Yeah, 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 I, I know you for the culture. I know you about the culture. I know you of the culture. He is the culture. And I know you is the culture. Right. Mm. But the thing about it is, like you said earlier, we got to start showing love to each other. You didn't have to come here. You didn't have to sit down. But we want we 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 wanted to give you your flowers face to face, man to man, because we are superheroes. And when I say we, I'm talking about us as the culture. That's we are super. Yeah, we, yeah, we, we all are yeah. superheroes. You, no, no, you, you, he's you, saying that's his for real. That's that is your for real. real. That's the Grammy. And, and, those, and Grammy. those flowers don't die. Yeah, they don't die. Snoop calls it a Grammy, but Shaq, I want to thank you. I'll put this next to my rings. In the house. Oh, oh. Yeah. oh. Come on, Shaq. Come on, Shaq. Come on, Shaq. So, so, listen, I just want to thank you so much as a person, as, 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 as a player, as a businessman. <laughs> as a real model. As a real model. A role and model. as a person, because... You inspire me to be better. There's times I just go on your Instagram or go and look at the internet and I see what you do for people that you randomly just meet. And that is that's an inspiration to me. That is so much positive energy. Like me, yes. you know, um, I'm a person that I wake up in the morning and I just, get, I just send positive energy messages. <laughs> what are you doing, Sonny? Sonny, what are you picking up? Oh, no, I'm, I'm looking at. At I'm what? Listening. <laughs> like, I'm down here. <laughs> I'm listening to what you're saying, and you know I agree with you. Because I be with you, man. So I'm I over say here, say. like, I'm in my own zone. And, and you know, I don't be on you know set. I don't be on set. They don't you, usually sit here. That's hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. But you know how I know how you get down. Yes. Positive you energy. know how much I understand where you coming from, from a good place. Okay. Nori is a great brother, and I'm wrapping it up. Continue. <laughs> what, what, what's the music? What's the music? Um, like, oh, like, when you wrap it up. Dad, I just want to thank you once again. All you got to do is do a couple of pitches and uh, drops, and you'll be done. And I want to say, yes. I, I don't know how people get on your show, but... Thanks for asking for me. Oh, yes. oh, no, no. I mean, I'm definitely a fan of the show. So when your man reached out to my guy, yes. he hated, I hated to say no, but I was like, I'm not going to be in New York for a while. Right. And he was like, they're in Miami. I was like, well, if they're in Miami, mm. let's do it. So yes. Yes. I'm actually here. And I, I was actually supposed to leave the day. We said, yo, we promised Nori you're going to do the show. I was like, yes. you know what? Oh, Nori's my guy. you my guy. So. Thank you. Appreciate it. And he's my guy too. Kevin, that's your name? Yeah, Sorry. yeah. Draymond. Yeah. 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 What was his yeah. name? Yeah. Draymond. Yeah. 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 Oh, you got the tape? Oh. I had to get it for hip hop, for us, for what oh, we do in Drink Champs. That's a, no. that's, I bought that that day. Shaq, my yes. The day of the release. He bought yeah, the day of the release. If, here. Oh, dope, bro, please. Please. You can sign. He oh. want the tape, nigga. He ain't trying to he sign. Oh, you want the tape? No, I'm getting it. 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 I'm getting
Oh, oh damn. damn. He, he got that shit. He that's from 2006. Oh, he killed uh, that. That was him. Sonny, what you got? What you got, Sonny? Right, so let me tell you. So let me right, tell you. Right, so I'm I'm up. Up. I swear, uh -huh. I got the 2006 Adidas Shell Toes. Please and thank you. Miami Heat Championship shell toes. The Adidas. cereal's still in there. And I didn't even think to bring it in the box. Everything. Eat the cereal and so, feel good about yourself. <laughs> so, <laughs> no, no, no. so even though I'm on this, I didn't approve this. Oh, wow. I'm gonna tell you why? I didn't know. Yeah, I'm going to tell you why. Cause, why is this? Because oh, okay. growing up in the hood, we never ate that. Uh. Yeah. So after the first championship, they call us and say, we want you to be on the cover. Nope. So I told my people, call Frosted Flakes. Oh. Mm. Right. Frosted Flakes they won't do that. So the second Tony the Tiger said yeah, no. He said no. So nah. second championship, they call us again. Wheaties, man, what you got? I said nope. Told my people call Fruit Loops. Fruit Loops, that Fruit Loops. Third championship, after Frosted Flakes said no, Wheaties call again. Won't you be in the thing? I said no. Call Diggum Smacks. Cause mm. like that's the stuff that we eat. That's the uh, stuff that we eat. So, Diggum Honey Smacks. So this one they did a deal with the NBA. They put me and D Wade on a couple. But oh. finally, last year. I did a deal with Frosted Flakes, and I've been on five million boxes of Frosted Flakes. Ooh, so Tony the Tiger. Yeah. Yeah. Tony yeah. paid up. Yeah, he paid up. Tony came through. Tony the Tiger. So it's, so yeah. it's uh, Frosted Flakes with cinnamon yeah, balls. So cinnamon balls. Yeah, cinnamon oh, balls. That's so real. Right. That's true, cinnamon balls. <laughs> I believe you. Right. <laughs> Don't you got Aunt Auntie's? What's, what's the pretzel shit? Sold it. Auntie so, Ann's. Damn, you just be buying shit and selling it? That's the game. That's the game. You, you Everything's for sale. Build it up, Shaq sell it for profit. Holy shit. I ain't gonna lie, Shaq. I learned so much Thank today. You. Like, Thank this you. podcast's gonna be for sale one day. Like, somebody gonna try to buy it. And, yes. <laughs> and they, they almost tried, and we almost lost, and we didn't yeah. do it. Wait, wait. Uh, What'd you say? Sure. They almost tried. Yeah. 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 Once again, Shaq, thank you so much. We'll take pictures. Um, uh, take pictures and a couple of drafts, and then we're done. Right, my my, my uh, other son. Oh, they're in here already. Where are your boys? Jack wants to say Hi, my name is Shaq. I'm not signing the thing. I'm here because I want to be here. Do what you got to do. That's it. That's it. That's it.